Hello everyone, it's Dan here. Welcome back. We are finally good to go. Red Dead Redemption and the Undead Nightmare DLC, the standalone DLC, originally released in, I believe, November of 2010, so a few months later than the initial launch of Red Dead Redemption. I'm ready to rock and roll with this. It has been regarded as one of the best DLCs to ever release, and I can attest to that. It's super creative. It's from a time when, when you got a $10 DLC, it wasn't for like a mission or two missions or this, that, and the other thing. Have you noticed that this game? I remember this, like these big DLCs were $10 and you got hours and hours and hours of content. I, like I said, the base game or whatever, like the base DLC runtime is roughly, I think about anywhere from four to eight hours, depending what you want to do. I think 100% completion might take you a little bit longer, but in terms of main missions, I think there's only about eight of them. So something like that, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, there's eight if you count the epilogue. So there's not much. I think we should be able to have it done in around six hours. I think that's probably what we're going to be doing. So it's going to be a one and done stream. We're back and we're, we got it working. So what I misunderstood about the last stream we started, guys, was yes. I, I mean, it, what, what, I don't think it was included, actually. So I assumed that it, because it was in the menu, that was just how you access it. So I could access this DLC from the base game if I wanted, but I have to have it installed first, which I didn't have. So fortunately, I already had my copy from way back in the day. Like I said, I played this like one time since I bought this, bought it brand new and god it's just yeah like literally everything about, i keep all my shit in mint condition if you looked how it's like crisp and clean this fucking case is you'd be impressed so anyway <laughs> we got it booted up we're ready to rock and roll thank you guys for your patience let's get started i cannot wait to get started obviously make sure you leave a like on the stream say what's up in chat hit that like button fam absolutely mm, 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 mm. i love those guys it gets so oh, it's... you know it's just like whoa all right well let's do it <laughs> anyway let's go through chat once again say hellos and we will actually get started with this all right let's go what up annie hey tanner what's up adam lenny phantom mickey and seven uh what's up zombie thomas okami what's good uh hey steven what's up kimmy uh what's up rex what's up amy what's up ward disney what's good uh what's up judd Brittany? hello what's up kuro what's up tim uh what's up darren uh, what's up, Cy Staley? Welcome, you guys. Thank you for coming back. Uh, I would have been so sad. What's up, Connor? <laughs> Kyosuke was good. And Smoka was good. Welcome. Thank you, guys. Anybody else lurking in the chat, thank you for coming. And I hope you guys are ready for some undead nightmare. It's going to be intense. I hope it will. What's up, Cyclones? All right, so if I actually hit single player, it's going to go straight into undead nightmare. Better. Better be. There's always that special feeling of, uh, you know, playing, like, having, a, like, your own physical copy of a game. Love in the time of plague. After months away, John Marston has returned to his loved ones. While trying to rebuild his ranch and win back the trust of his family, Marston awaits whatever life will throw at him. As he drives home one evening from an errand, he ponders whether a man can ever escape his past. He is a man who is ready for anything. anything <laughs> so this kind of takes place before the end of the game but when he returns home to his ranch so it's like in that Marson ranch chapter oh it's Ami you know what you know what's funny about that is that I was going to say Ami I swear to shit I was going to but I'm like mm, what if it's Amy and I said it wrong I should have just went with my instinct. I'm, you know, that's so stupid. I knew it was. I knew it was, and I'm like, well, maybe they could smell it with an uh, eye. So I gambled. Damn. Mother. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I meant to say, damn this awful son I've raised with his half pollutant ways and his shame that his mother swears like a sailor and sews like a blind man. Uh, is that better? Your lordship. Much better, mother dearest. Oh, good. I'm so glad, my darling. 
when you finished your university education and are far too good to even acknowledge my existence when we pass on the street, and you gently kick me aside and beg an old crow out of the way with your highly polished boot. Well, think of me kindly at least, will you, my son? I'll try to, Mother. I'll think, that woman I just kicked, that used to be my dear old potty mouth mom. Maybe I should bother to kick her harder. <laughs> dear boy. Oh, I am so proud of you. Get off. Now, father's here. Maybe he can beat some sense into you. Something funny's going on out there. Damn dogs gone crazy and wolves howling and birds flying. Well, it's just the storm, John. Maybe. Uncle make it back yet? I thought he was with you off drinking in the fields. I mean working, as you call it now. No, uh, he went into town a few hours ago after we busted that hammer working out in the meadow. Well, he's probably holed up in some place of ill repute waiting for the passing of the storm. I hope so. Well, that old man can take care of himself. I know. Just a funny feeling I got. You can't psychic, Paul? Either that or I ate something funny. <laughs> Knowing your mother's cooking. Seems more than likely. Mm. Well, talking about food, who's ready for some poisoning? <laughs> Me, my darling. I am starving. What's up, Tyler? Just some book about monsters. Tell me about it. Convenient. It's kind of dumb. That should suit me just fine. Well, it's all about, in ancient times, how Aztec warriors worshipped the sun. But during full moons, some of them worshipped the moon instead. And upset the equilibrium of things. So anyway, w what it involves is, there's this one guy, and he goes out in search of this... him all alone. So anyways, since there ain't no cure, the brave man has to kill everybody, which is absolutely disgusting and completely <laughs> unbelievable. It's getting late. Guess we're not going to see uncle till morning. Come on then, Abigail. <sighs> Jack, get yourself to bed, boy. Try to get some sleep. Ain't you worried about uncle? Sure, but he'll have to wait till morning just like any other man would in his shoes. Night, son. Don't stay up reading too late. Yeah, I'm playing on Series X right now. Pretty much the only place you can play it is Xbox at the moment. You okay, old man? You don't look so good. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what is going on? That's the universal sound of not being alive. What are you, what are you, where are you going? Where are you going? To get my gun. Oh. Oh. His bone is sticking out his arm, man. Playing the whole thing, Ray. Whole thing. Oh shit! Uncle! You dumb son of a bitch! Stop! Nobody puts their hands on my wife! It's too late, bro. It's too late. I 
I can't believe I had to kill that poor bastard. I... Well... You okay, darling? You okay? Oh. Abigail. Abigail. I don't feel so great. Jack! Get out here! Now! Oh, good Lord, what's happened? Mama! Careful, boy. Mama! Stay right there, the pair of them. Don't make me no widower now. Happens pretty quick, doesn't it? Son, you're grounded. Literally, you're on the ground. Maybe this will remind you how to behave. Sick, crazy bastards, or what I've done to you, but I'm going to get help. Stay calm. As calm as you can, seeing as both of you seem to have gotten a little excited. Probably just a fever. Jack, be kind to your mother. Abigail, teach the boy right from wrong. Both of you, stop biting chunks out of people. Be back as soon as I can. This DLC was like more than just horror, it was like horror comedy, so it had that bit of fun to it, you know? Guess I best go find me a doctor in town. Okay, what do I have in my inventory? I actually have a warhorse in my inventory. But I know you get like a, a unique horse in this game too. At least we can get some speed here, guys. Alright, we're going in town. So the Undead Nightmare storyline is upon us. Let's go. Seriously, I haven't actually played Undead Nightmare since 2011. That was the last time I played it. So this has been a long time. Long, long time. So every time you, you start singing music now, you can't just be like, I've been through the desert on a horse with no name. It's got to be like, <laughs> like, you know, <laughs> some of you don't even have tongues, right? So you can't even pronounce certain words. <laughs> That's stupid. That is stupid. I love how they're giving you a little reminder of like everything. You know, it's like we know you guys have been away for a while, so. I mean, despite a few fires here and there, that town looks more or less intact. Oh, right, the Four Horse of the Apocalypse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love how everybody had time to write that shit. Oopsie. Hello? Mr. 
Mr. Marston, sir! Marston! It's me! Professor, what are you doing here? I thought you went back to Yale. Well, I did, but uh, I came back uh, for another round of research. <laughs> and now all hell is quite literally broken loose. What is going on? Well, well sir, I am a man of science, a man of great learning, a, a thinker, a, a wise man, and I'll be honest with you, sir, I haven't got a fucking clue. <laughs> Why that dandy? What, what should we do? Well, I suggest we try to find other survivors, band together, and find a cure. Or fight to the death trying. Well, well that sounds great and all, but, uh, but I'm uh, just peachy. But, but I'm not sure that I'm, I'm not cut out for such shenanigans. I, I was thinking more that uh, finding a horse and, and riding back to the civilized north at the speed of knots before writing a paper on the events from the comfort of my study. I'm a scientist after all, right? I mean, I, I, I can't do much science if I'm some bloodshot dervish's lunch, can I? Much as I would like. Your sense of duty is very impressive, Professor. I'm gonna search the back street for survivors. No, no, no. Be, perhaps staying with you would be safer. Uh, could, could you just wait a sec here, would you please? I, I'm going to wander down that lonely, deserted street and get my bag. <laughs> wait, you should stay with me, Professor. You haven't got a gun. Oh, no, no, it's okay. There's no need to worry. Everyone's already dead. <laughs> I left my stuff with Mr. Nastas. Uh, you remember him. Uh, Indian fellow, dumb as bricks, but, uh, but a good sort. Okay. Well, meet me in a couple minutes. Affirmative. A couple of minutes. <sighs> Instant death. <laughs> Nastas just takes him out. <laughs> We do it. I liked him too. Oh Jesus! Where'd you come from? Ah! Where do these people keep spotting from? Time to go. Run, Johnny, run, run. Johnny, just run. Anyone here? Hello? Anyone here? Here, mister. Come out. It's okay. Come out. I don't bite. Bad joke. I mean, come out. And mine, I fear. I saw my mama rip my daddy's face off and drink his blood. And they were happily married 20 years. I'm sorry. We were so glad to see my mama. Because she's been dead for three years from the smallpox. Your mama was dead? I saw her walk up onto the porch. Mister, he weren't. Sure, he liked to drink, but but he weren't bad. And sure, he liked the company of women, but he weren't bad, Mister. He weren't. No one deserves to have their blood drunk. I mean, he knew how to use his fist. And if if a woman spoke out her place, he reminded her of it and everything. And when my mama was dying. People said that he was lying with her sister, but that weren't true, mister, it weren't. But you said your mother was dead. Yeah, her and Mr. Braithwaite. He's been dead a year. And then yesterday, he walked up that street eating dogs. And he loves animals. All the dead folk have come back to life, mister. Only they ain't happy. It's a funny kind of salvation. All the dead folk? All the folk buried at the cemetery, over by the churchyard. My God. I'm gonna go have a look. You wanna come? No, I already seen my mama. I don't need to see any more of my relatives. 
Here, mister. Take this. If you can burn them, maybe you can put their souls to rest. I, uh, mister! You see my uncle Mordecai? Burn him. Burn him real good, you hear? All right. How far away do you think they are? Just keep running. Come on, Johnny Mars. I wonder if the horse would have made sense. What's up, T-Roy? What's up, Tracy? Damn it, it's probably way further. It kind of is. Hey, Chris, thanks for being a member for the last 18 months. Wow, it really does, doesn't it? Much love, thank you very much. Oh, you want some of this? You want some of the sauce? Let's dance. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Take your vitamins. All right, let's go. Okay, all right, come on. The zombies are coming. Wait, didn't they change the position of where the cemetery was? Stop, stop, stop. I think all that did was just make him spawn. I think I think she was behind it. <laughs> Don't mind me. Just keep running. See, in this one, I love how in various zombie movies and, you know, bits of media, um, each zombie is different than the last. Like, sometimes zombies are slow and easy to avoid, but when they get, it's, you know, the herd mentality. Other films and media, they're like fast as fuck, boy. You know what I mean? All right, who wants some of the sauce? Undead with undead with ammo belts will carry shit. So it's probably good to loot them then. Wherever. Oh, I thought that was a cow. Isn't that a person? Apparently not. It's a tree. Stay dead, please. Think I'll lose you the first time you die. That's a bit alarming. But because dead eye's so fast, it's like. <laughs> There's Mordecai. Did you just see the ladies? <laughs> Would you kindly point me in the direction of them undead bitches? Fucking die? Ah, right, this bitch been cleansed. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to step in your face. Come on, horsey. The music and everything is just so good. It's like all very atmospheric and... Come here. Come here. Can you imagine? 
Uncle Mordecai. Great man. Did well by him. Did well by his family. Oh, really? Who said that? Uncle Mordecai. <laughs> I did play Lollipop Chainsaw, yeah, many, many. Woo -hoo! Okay, the audacity of this bitch. Sorry about that. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Dies by fire. How embarrassing. How embarrassing. Lost a planet, Master Obi Wan has. <laughs> Okay, stop jumping around like a ding-a-ling. Search the corpse. Time. Bitch. Whoops. I missed. I missed. Ah! <laughs> he did. The blade down. Put the bird down. Got to double tap, my friend. Right in the cheeks, baby. What's up, Seago? Where the people at? You guys are spawning in a bit slowly. say no you've cleansed it and you have to do that with like i think all of the major towns i think you can actually go you actually go in there too you actually go into um whatchamacallit now this is really low okay horso i've been through the desert with a holy fuck All right, next mission. What's up, Edwin? Thanks, man. Thank you kindly. <laughs> Series X. Folks, okay? But yes. Just fantastic. <sighs> I just saw my daughter get eaten by some creature sent straight from hell. Thanks for asking. You're welcome. I'm kind of sorry I did. Sorry, mister. Forgive my wife. We've suffered terribly. What's going on? Well, it's the government's fault. Ain't it always? Well, they let in too many foreigners. Just shut the goddamn border. <laughs> things like this happen. My daughter was just some satanic demon's lunch because of the goddamn government. Fucking, well, like, trips happen. and falls down, like, a you fucking see? chasm. I oh, I blame the government. The These dead borders. I ain't a wise man, <laughs> but I have done a little traveling. 
These creatures ain't like any foreigners I've ever seen. That's <laughs> the Mexican. <laughs> Jesus. Monsters feasting on my family, and I'm taking advice about tolerance from a gunslinger. What in the world has my life come to? And my daddy told me I never should have gotten married. This is all your fault, you, you useless man. Oh, not now, Doreen. Not this again. <laughs> Your daddy was a, a bully and a drunk. Well, you ain't no kind of man. Listen. <laughs> I'm sorry to interrupt. Every time she starts crying, I think of that dude, the greatest cry help. ever. You got any idea? <laughs> 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 Try shooting the creatures. Ma'am. You know what I mean? It's been a real pleasure. Sir, you're a man of great patience. Very true. You must, you must be best friends with the drink. <laughs> it must be. you one of them, Mister? Do I look like one of them? Don't come no closer. We made that mistake before. Lost half our number. I ain't one of them, you fool. Well, how do I know? They can't speak. Well, I ain't taking no chances. Kill him. He's one of them. Yeah. No, I ain't. Don't take no chances, Silas. Have it your way, all right? Listen. I ain't coming no closer. Do you know what's going on? It's the glass eye. The freak with the glass eye. He caused this. No, no, no. It's the snake oil man. These poor folks have been drugged. I blame the Mexicans. <laughs> I was wondering what that would happen. <laughs> we heard a lot of stories, mister. Some say it's a moon. Some say it's drugs. They don't come no closer now. Stand back. Apparently it's worse in New Austin. Must be where it came from. It looks like I'm headed down to New Austin. Did one of you say snake oil? It's the glass eye. I blame the Mexicans. <laughs> Connie McTavish, you don't know nothing. You always was an ignorant shrew. I bet your husband's glad he's dead. <gasps> <laughs> At least my husband never took favors from the stargazers, Lucille Billingsgate. You say you're sorry, you hillbilly white trash. Yeah, yeah, now how are we going to rebuild America like this? Now, see, I thought we had it all decided. We was going to be kind and gentle and pay homage to our leader, who happens to be me. Sounds like you folks have this all worked out. Have yourself a fine America, and good luck. We never had that decided. We decided we would hold elections and that I would be leader. You um, can't even read. Well, I, I got gravity. Well, I mean, gravity. Uh, you might want to. I mean, uh, folk respect me. I am the new king, Archibald Andrews. Turn it around, Dink. Uh, yeah, over, yeah, yeah. Get the races first. Get the races first. He's like, fuck it, I'm out. Was that the racist? What am I doing here? Fuck if I know, bro. Bye. It's a bolter undead. She have any good swag on her? How about this guy? Oh, hi. Welcome to the land of the unliving. Right back down. It's a very unflattering. Oh, okay. Lady, stay dead. Jesus Christ. All right, Horso, let's get out of here. Man, that is the most American name I think I've ever seen. Buck Dingles. Howdy. I'm Buck Dingles. A Buck Dingles skin slave. Sla slave? How do you say that shit? My name Buck Dingles. I feel like he would do, he's the kind of, Buck Dingles is the guy who would do his own infomercials. Ha! My name Buck Dingles. <laughs> Hold on. Birth of the Conversa Conserva Conservation Movement. We'll go there first, I guess. What would Buck Dingles sell? I mean, he seems like the kind of guy who would sell snake oil. Ha! My name Buck Dingles. Oh right, I don't get to, I don't get to camp. It's too dangerous to camp. Yeah. 
Or an exotic dancer, yeah. No, I think that would be Buck Dingleberry. Dingleberries. Plural. Come on. Hi, ladies. Would you like to try a couple of my dingleberries? Wonga, 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 wonga. You know what I mean? Undead doggos. <laughs> no. uh, I feel like Buck Dingles would sell like roof shingles. Ha! I'm Buff Dingles. Or Buff Dingles roof shingles. Buck Dingles roof shingles. You ever get fucking sick and tired? Of rainwater getting in on your place of that the good Lord intended you to have? Are you sick and fucking tired of the government trying to impose bullshit on you? Well, fear not. Buck Dingles, Roof Shingles is here to save the day. Keeping you dry? Let's go. All the while. I don't know. Something of that nature, I would imagine. I don't know you guys, but I know I would. I'd, I'd get a Buck Dingles Roof Shingle. Personally, if it ain't a dingle, <laughs> <Let's go. laughs> if you need some shingles, give me a ringle. <laughs> e break. Oh, 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 I got one, Mister. Hey, I got one. Got what, Mister? The damn Sasquatch. The filthy thing was gonna eat my dog when this girl hollered out, and I shot the thing right through the heart. Oh, my God. You feeling all right, mister? I've seen a lot of strange things recently, but no Sasquatch running around here. Nor no place else. They, they're made up. There's Sasquatches every place, Cowboy. They're not. Not in this game. Your mother-in-law with a bad case of that virus. Down in Manzanita the Post, they ate a little girl. Are you serious? Do I look like I'm joking? The hills are infested with them. Kill them. Kill the bastards before they kill all of us. Kill them. Kill them. I ain't afraid of you, you dumb hairy bastards. And they're misunderstood creatures. You're supposed to keep an eye on them. I remember that. Kill six Sasquatches and tall trees. This I remember doing. Am I in tall trees? Yeah. And I remember you find... Well... Let's just go there then. I feel bad, because like I think you kill five and the sixth one like... Gives in or whatever. Not gives in, but... Oh my god! Dude, where's my fucking horse? At least it shows me where they are instead of wasting a bunch of time, you know? That's a demon hog! Come on, oh my god, there he is! <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, mister.
Alright, hold on. Come here, please. Alright, next one. He's just a big misunderstood hairy boy. <laughs> oh my god. If anything, Sasquatches are very Canadian. And they're of the woods. You know what I mean? Watch me go after this guy. He's like, oh, fuck there, bud. You scared me. Please don't shoot me. Oh, shit. I'm dead, bud. That wasn't very nice of you. Sorry I got in your way there. I was just trying to eat some of Buckberry's Dingleberries. <laughs> Whatever his name Buckberry Dingleberry. <laughs> I'm skipping this guy. I'm si I'm skipping him this time. Easy. Come on. Hello. Hello. Oh, sorry there. Did I startle you? These poor schmucks, bro. Okay, it won't let me loot him right now, so. I think I can't go to that yet. I think I know what that is. Demon hogs. Come on. I can't remember if that's actually the guy. Oh no, that's the area, right? Never mind, that's the area. So that clears the. I think I saw him. There he is. Get eyes on him. Poor guy shot him right in the fucking back. Sorry, Mr. Sask. Come on. I see him. This one is honestly kind of fucking sad, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, bud. Come on. Seth, finally I've joined. I remember doing this like late in the game. Maybe I did do it right off the snuff. I don't remember, but I did. I did do Let's this. Go. Last one. Oh. <laughs> Poor guy. Shoot me, human. Shoot me. Oh, I will, you foul creature of the night. You'll be granting me peace. Why's that? Keep you from eating more babies? In the name of all the traits. What are you talking about, human? You eat babies. You have to to survive. Everyone knows that. Ain't your fault. We eat berries and mushrooms, you fool. But we 
did. Now none of us are left. Some maniac's been murdering us. The last of my kind. We've lived in these hills a thousand years. You eat babies. If you say so, human. My family is gone. My kind is gone. Shoot me. I can't take it anymore. Make it stop. <laughs> I ended up shooting him because I felt bad. It's almost like it's like euthanasia. I don't know, man. What the fuck? What the fuck? You know what? You get to live for that. See you later. <laughs> okay. Who are you? You look pretty sick. <laughs> this doctor. Doctor Six Shooter. Reporting for duty. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, guys. What a bunch of shit show. All right, anyways. Um, there is another one of these question marks. Dinner for two. But this is closer, so we'll go hit that up first. Again, I don't have the campfire anyway. Anyway, guys, let's get back. Let's go find. I don't know if we're going to Uncle or or what. Not Uncle, sorry. Uh, Wes Dickens. What's up, Doman? Yeah. Figure we do some back-to-back -back Red Dead before the new game comes. Oh my God! I know where we are. This is where we were trying to catch those beavers yesterday, guys. Undead beavers. Not sure I want to see that. See, the downside about this is I can't fast travel, but I think that's how they add to the longevity of the game. I, mean, I think you can fast travel, but you have to, like, clear the way. So instead of using a camp, you, like... Or it's like until you like clear out enough zombies in the area, that's the same thing. It's like the safety or whatever. No, God no, Zacky. This game came out, or this, well, it's an expansion. I just want to see. Hold on. Yeah, this came out in 2010. We cracked the 12 year anniversary back in November. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, you're right about that. Clear out the hordes. Kind of like what I did for Blackwater. But I gotta go easy on my shots because I'm running out of ammo. Whoa, whoa. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You can go that way.
So I think I'd have to, in order to clear it, I think I have to go here. To each one of these question marks. And then I can do a mission from that. They might be worth doing, but they're not essential. But they might be good for a save point, right? So. I mean, there's auto save. Don't get me wrong. Unfortunately, Tall Trees is kind of a a bit out of the way for us, so it's like... Come on. Why has he still got his weapon drawn? Oh, Jesus, tits! some Why is it so slow? My nose has gotten insanely itchy, guys. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. I was aggressive. Ah. That one is so savage. Why is she, wait, why wouldn't it target her? Jesus. Okay, it's not ending. I might have to go talk to them. What the hell? He's got no head. What the hell? Are you sure you're not one of them? That was weird. What's going on? What happened? Guys, did something happen?
Nothing's budging. It's all fucking bugged out. I think something happened. I'm gonna get out of here. That sucks. What a waste of time. Let's go. I was supposed to help them, but then all their heads disappeared. So yeah, now it's frozen. So like, they're like regular now. I don't know. Yeah, just start stop starting to add up. I wonder if it's because I left town. Now everyone's head is gone. It's very strange. Come on. Come on, easy up now. Seth. I mean, Seth. if you're not you careful, ready? Seth looks like on? he's one of them. Hey there, John. Fancy a game of cards? You know what I mean? Not you right gotta be, you gotta look to do a double take with Seth. You remember Moses, John? He's, 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 a, he's a darn sight more loyal now than he was before. <laughs> uh, come here, boy. Come on. Come here, boy. Oh. Oh. What are you doing? We were boyhood friends, John. Moses is having a tough time right now. Ain't you, pal? What's going on? We're playing cards. Relax, sit down. I mean, with the undead walking the face of the earth, you crazy dumb bastard. That ain't nothing. Ain't nothing? I've seen husbands eating wives. Mothers eating sons. Graves popping open and the undead rising up. Graves popping sure each other's assholes. Oh, boo-hoo. Big tough John Marson is scared of a little undead creature walking around. Moses wouldn't hurt a fly, would you, darling? Besides, this ain't nothing new. Folks in Blackwater blaming it on that glass eye you found. Folks! 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 Damn them folks, John Marston! Damn them! And damn you! Get him! Get him, Moses! Get him! After all I've done for you, Seth, and I thought loyalty was important to you. You can't hurt me. Moses, get him. Go! Yeah. Get him! Get me, Moses. Looks like your dog's lost his bite, Seth. Now what the hell's going on? The dead are risen, and a virulent plague is... Turning people into flesh eating crazies. What the hell you think's going on, genius? But why? But why? 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 Why not? Why not? <laughs> why the hell not? Because it ain't natural. Who made you Mother Nature and Mother Superior all at the same time? Who made you, John Marston? Same as made me, same as made Moses. Is there a cure? These things tend to fade away. Now, if you want to get rid of it, you should go clear the graveyards. Either that, or stop worrying and become one of them. Now, if you excuse us, we got good times to remember. Happy times. Okay. See you soon then, Seth. So weird. So I've got to start clearing grave... Come on, Moses. It's your deal. Diamonds are trumps. Come on. <laughs> he doesn't want to play. All right, three new Austin graveyards. 
current ability or current objective. Let's see where we are. So it's on the way. So we'll go here. Boom, boom, boom. Or maybe boomity boomity. Or maybe boomity boomity boomity. I mean, there's a save point here. I'm going to actually save. Hold up. Seth, I hope you don't mind. I'm just going to take a shit in your toilet. You ain't exactly a rat. <laughs> What kind of elvis do we got? Undead Hunter. The Union suit. Basically, it's in our underwear. It's in our skivvies. The duster coat looks pretty slick. Uh, it almost looks Zombie Hunter-esque. In this case... Well, Zombie Hunter-esque. There you go. It's like Vampire Zombie Hunter-esque. What up, Liam? How you doing? Um, yeah, if you want to maybe help out, that'd be fucking sweet. What the fuck? It better have saved, man. Oh my God. Great. Thanks for that. Oh, oops, wrong one. Now, what's with all these bugs? I wonder if that bug actually caused that issue. I hope it's saved. I, it usually auto saves after you start a mission, though. So, at the very least, we should have an auto save. Even if that last one didn't save. I don't know. Dum dum dum, 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 dum dum dum. When the night has come. Okay, well, it didn't really. Okay, well, it saved it there. It just didn't say... Okay, so yeah, it just kind of spawned us. Status under attack. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I went to. Oof, that's annoying that it spawned us at Beecher's Hope. That is actually really fucking annoying. Because now we have to go all the way back there. Might be able to get... Okay, hold on. Apparently, I could save it here. Is there like a, a bed up top? Let's see if my save is even there. No, it didn't save that. Okay, yeah, something happened. That's annoying. So now I have to go all the way back there, guys. That is a bit of a kick in the nips. And since I don't have a fast travel, it's just gonna... Come here! Oh my god! The fucking horse is running away from me. Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah, but I don't really think Revolver has anything to do with this. I heard the game wasn't even that good, but... I thought about it. Maybe when we go through that... Uh, I, I, is that that's not Thieves Landing. No, it's not Thieves Landing. I can't remember the name of that town. Maybe if we go through there... Man, it had to crash there, didn't it? If anything, it's just going to add some time to the run. Let's go. 
So yeah, Dixon Crossing is the place that was under attack. What the fuck is happening? Stop! Dude, I keep getting stuck on stuff. Oh my god. It's not at all annoying. It's telling me to talk to him, but I'm trying to talk to him and it's just nothing happens. Either give ammo or you can just shoot them. I mean it waste both. Dude, stop! Stop! I gotta switch. I'm fucked. Time to go! Now I'm out of ammo, big players. Wow, I missed it. Oh, boo. happening this calm you down. Calm yourself, sister. What's up Adam oh, Adam yeah thank you for being a member for the last month appreciate it There, I just gotta loot them for that ammo. Oh, shit. I knew I could shoot. There we go. Another save point. Hope you find rest now, miss. All right, this place now has a safety. Right, let's keep moving. I think if if you have certain you, you like save a few towns on your way, it's gonna make it a little bit easier. Whoops. What's up, Ramon? How you doing? I guess I should have went to that safe spot and opened up the chest to get ammo. Even when I respawned or reloaded my game, I should have done it then too. Because ammo's in fairly short supply. You have to like really save it. Alright, where are we on the map? I mean, there's a town here, McFarland's Ranch. Oh! 
By starting or continuing a... Oh, I have to save the town. This one's a big town, though. That's the problem with it. But she got to... Okay. They don't have much. <laughs> she tripped and she fell. Hey, did she bleed? Melee is kind of not as satisfying. You gotta be careful when burning those guys, because they're just gonna burn the whole building down. Hit her! Jesus, hit her! Torch. As I'm just kicking her while she's down. Where's this other guy? Don't you come alive again now. Good, we got it. All right, well, let's go do this one. I'm assuming it's the McFarlands. Like, who else could it be? 
the earth and you turn up. Could my week get any worse? Oh, nice to see you too, Miss McFarland. Oh, I thought you'd be dead. I heard things were bad in West Elizabeth. Sure. <laughs> but it'll take more than an apocalypse to take me down. What are you? A demon or a cockroach? Both, I fear. How's your father? Fine and dandy. He should be coming out of that barn any moment now. Daddy! What's he doing in the barn? Daddy, John's here! Mr. Marston, you remember? That idiot bounty hunter. What was he doing in the barn? Just rounding up the undead and keeping them safe so the rest of us can go about our business. He's a real man. He's probably playing around with them. Daddy, stop teasing me! Now come on now! How long's he been in there? Not long. Only since yesterday. Yesterday? I better go have a look for him. Would you, John? You are kind. Call out to me if you find anything. I will do. I mean, it's not going to be good for us here, or for him. So the same way we climbed beforehand. Or nearly. Yeah, I think so. I think I remember doing this. Fucking bugs, bro. I'm wasting shots because of that. You have to pretend like they're there. Are you shocked? His head disappeared. Sorry, Mr. McFarland. You were a good man. Claw at my back, I'll claw at yours. Damn this godforsaken shithole! I mean, I got me a new weapon, though. So that's nice. What if I get to stay in my the old the same room I was in before? The only thing is, I'm a little nervous. I'm going to finish this first so I get an autosave. Because, um, last time I tried saving once the glitch happened, it actually caused... It, it didn't save, so...
Well, John, you always do bring sunshine to my life. I'm sorry about your father. I'd like to say he died doing what he loved. But he never was one for eating folk. Not slathering from the lips and howling at the moon. I guess I'll content myself with saying that he died protecting those he loved. Indeed. Well? Take care of yourself, Bonnie. You too, John. Mission done. Can I not get in there? Or is it on the side? Any and all bits of ammo I would appreciate. Thank you all very much. Alright, I don't know if it's saved or not. But I'll save here just in case. I love how the, the save points are in new locations. Like this is the this is the prison before. But it's a good bet. And it's safe. Let's hope we have a good save. Nope. Nope, it glitches. Whenever that happens, the save won't work. That's kind of annoying, guys, but that's actually a big problem. Um, but fortunately, it did save. Ooh, I didn't want the game card. Fuck, bro. That is such a... That's a... I've never had this happen before, though. I know, Like, when I played it originally... So every time their heads disappear, it won't save. It'll crash when I save. It doesn't even crash. It just goes black screen. I have to force close it. But like I said, I never had this problem when I played last time. So it's kind of... If anything, it's just going to slow us down. So that's why I waited for an autosave. It did autosave after, I think, the McFarlane one. So this one, we might just have to run off autosaves. But, I mean, I can't help wanting to save every now and then. I'm just hoping I should be in the McFarlane Ranch. I'm hoping. That was the last save. Based on this image here, I'd say we are correct. I'm surprised they never patched that. I mean, I guess it was a known issue. And it was never patched. That's pretty fucked up. Can I stop saying what bad word? Dude, this is... Oh, that's so annoying. You're in a... You're in a not safe for children stream. This is an M-rated game. Oh, God, that's cringe. I will say whatever I want. If you don't like it, then you can go to another stream. Jesus Christ. I'm actually going to go over here just to get the ammo. Oh, it resets all the ammo anyway. It's weird in the daytime. About time. At least everyone's somewhat back to snuff. All right, let's take a look. So I've still got this marked, so we're going to mark that again. That'll be our next one. That's one of the graveyards. Then we'll go do the other stranger mission. Come on. I'm just going to run these bad boys down. 
Aw, oh, that was actually kind of anticlimactic. I thought it would be a little bit more aggressive. I know I can fast travel from save points, Matt. But I can't fast travel to areas I haven't found yet, so... I think it's just to the, the places I've cleared. I just want to see something. Yeah, that's the uh, that's that's the issue. Annie, with now using low latency, you'll get the occasional buffer. Because like if you were, if I were to like go with my traditional normal latency, you'll have like a 15 to 20 second chat delay. So basically, what you see happens 20 seconds in the past had already happened 20 seconds ago. But the the, the upside with normal or low latency is that. Um, you guys only have to wait a couple of seconds after I say something. I think it's like four or five seconds after I say something to actually hear it live. Ooh, mythical creature appeared in the eye. Oh, dude, let's go. Come on. It's a horse of the apocalypse. Let's cap it. Dibs. Come here. Get on it. Jesus. What the fuck, man? He won't get on it. Are you actually serious, dude? I I literally was mash Oh my god, if I lose this horse. Let's go. Go get it. Good thing you can see it pretty easily. It would not get on the fucking horse. Stop it. There we go. Gotta break this horse, man. Easy now, Mr. Great Maniac. That's it. That'd be a hot horse. These bad boys are three-star horses, if I'm not mistaken. Well, creature of the night. I got you now. This is what hell is wrong. Come on, baby, don't lose it. Yes, sir. Let's go. Come on, come on. Oh, really, Mo? The horse is burning? I didn't notice at all. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> yeah. It is one of the four horses of the apocalypse. There's one from each representation of that. Burn him. So step one, just burn all the coffins. Yeah, I think, I, like, it's not always going to be, uh, like, on my end. Like, I didn't notice any... It says it's Gucci, that's the difference. Sometimes it'll just happen because of the low latency. But, and it will, like, my stream health will be perfect. It's just a YouTube thing. Yeah, death. I, I think I ended up getting death. I think you unlock death, like, towards the end, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. All right, I whipped out a shotgun, didn't I? Yeah, yeah. All right, that, oh, shit. Some of them just sound like a guy screaming in slow motion, you know what I mean? Get right back to bed.
Why are you still standing? Alma Horlick. Oh, you remember her? She was the one looking for her long lost husband. Are you still breathing? She'll get two to the dome. Send her home. Good night. Thanks for the shoes. I never ended up doing the Chupacabra one, believe it or not. I knew this was a waste of time. I can't remember if you can like spawn the horses on your own or not. Yeah, Brian, I already ran into Seth. We're doing his missions right now. Oh, I can't even help them until the town's cleared. I forgot about that. They, I love how they just yeet you off. Time to run. I'm stuck. No, don't get stuck now. Wait, is this armadillo? This is armadillo, isn't it? Yeah. Jesus Christ, on a dude, take out your gun. This is getting stupid. I ran out. Yeah, I think that's war, yeah. Time to go! <laughs> that guy fucked up my shot, actually. Like one more wave. I might have managed to actually pop that one over there. There, now just clear out the last little bits, the stragglers. And that's another town in the books, y'all. They're actually helping, which is impressive. Uh, 
Ah, the two. Oh, let's go. All right, we got it. All right, it did save. Um, I, everyone's heads are still around, so I should, in theory, be able to still save it. Clearing out Armadillo is a pretty um, power move, because it's kind of like a central hub in this area. So let's hope everything saves nicely and not, like, kicking us back. Yep. Honestly, you're probably better off if you get an autosave, load, like, as soon as you get an autosave and you, the glitch happens, reload from there. And then call it a day. Oh, it's probably the sheriff. Wow, you just let that happen, bro? Sorry, boys. She didn't give me a whole lot of choice. Hello, John. Welcome to paradise. Hello, Marshal. <laughs> Might have known you'd survive. What's going on? Do I look like I commune with the undead? I don't know. Well, then how would I know? My job is to take care of the folk who live here. Oh, you <laughs> heard that one. How's that going? How's that going? Well, let me put it to you this way. Cattle rustling and bank robbery are at an all-time low. But murder, blood drinking, and psychotic episodes seem to be somewhat prevalent. Either that, or I'm dreaming. That's what I'm hoping, too. How was it getting in here? It was crazy. They must be hiding again. They come in and then just disappear. Town's been nearly overrun a couple of times. Now we're low on ammunition, and I'm two men down. I'll help you clear the place out if you like. You're a good man, John Marston. But before that, I'm gonna need my deputies back. What happened to them two clowns you had before? Gone? Maybe. I sent Jonah off to look for Eli. They've both been gone for several hours now. Who'd want to eat one of them? <laughs> That's a good question. Where'd you send them? Out near the general store. Jonah's got one of these new guns. I'm sure he can't run into any trouble. These things, they'd stop an elephant. Thank you. No, thank you. I'm sure you got your own troubles. All right, well, we'll keep an eye out for him. Hold on a second. Around Armadillo. So we don't actually know where they are, per se. I don't really know how far out they would be. Unless they're in Armadillo. It said around it, but... I don't think I ever did this. It's been so long, though. I, I could have done it. Oh, dear God. I just saved your fucking life. There you go. She gave me some ammo. What are you thinking? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, he was undead. Thanks for the help.
What's up, PWG? Isn't this it? Oh, it must be inside. More valuable than gold now. That it is. I'm surprised it's not giving me any search locations, though. That's kind of annoying. But hey, at least we have another fast. See, we got fast travels kind of all over the place now. They're spaced out nicely. The farm. And then we got to go there, which I believe is West Dickens. But we'll finish off Seth's mission at first. Oh, hold on. It's actually showing an M location on each map. I see now. Hey, mister. Hey, pard. You seen a couple deputies nearby? Marshall's boys. Jonah and Eli. Uh, are they Jews, mister? They sound like Jews. <laughs> I don't know. Why? Why? <laughs> this whole thing is nothing but a Jewish plot. You do know that, don't you? I find that highly unlikely, amigo. Well, I don't like Jews. Or colored folk. Oh, Jesus. Or natives, now that you mention it. Well, you're a nice, kind-hearted man to meet in a time of trouble. He'll get his. Don't worry. Kind does not come into it. Why? What are you talking about? Why? I bet you like Catholics. I can't stand them neither. Nor women. Fabians, socialists, homosexuals, Asians, or British. Between them, they've ruined this country. Ruined it. It was a good country once. Now people are eating each other. And it's all the fault of the Jewish, British, Catholic, homosexual elite and their ideas. Well, I, for one, won't Everyone's got to blame it on some group, you know? Have you ever met a Jewish person? <laughs> Thankfully not. Or a uh, British, Catholic, homosexual? British, <laughs> Catholic, homosexual. Dude, no, there's uh, no way. I, I see you acting clever. <laughs> Well, let me tell you this. Oh. The Jews killed Lincoln. That's why there is a triangle on the money. And they run Europe like one of them Arabian harems. Now they've sent this here plague to kill all us decent folk. That's why, yep. yep. You, sir, are truly a remarkable fella. Kill off all the Thank people who kindly. fund the co economy. Say, it's a rare pleasure to meet pay someone taxes. with such a grasp on human history. You take care of yourself. I'd hate to see you get savaged by someone and watch the life force drain from your hate-filled body. Hey, hold on there. Why don't you join me in my fight, sir? It's not too late. I fear it is for me. Then I will fight them alone. All of them. America is the land of the free. And that means free to people like me, Herbert Moon. <laughs> Absolutely. No. Oh, no, no. That is just, it's so good. Look, a Brit, a gay guy, and a Catholic all taking him down right now. <laughs> That'd be too funny if that was the case. You know he did. I might leave him. You know what? You guys can keep munching on him. Munch on their lunch. Bop them in the nose. Oh, yeah. Three horns and long necks and duck feet, too. They all want to do, have to do, anything you want them to. Okay, where are you? Where art thou? They get, this is a large search. Honestly, I should have my horse with me. War, get your ass over here. Get, I hate when they run away when you're trying to get on. We had this problem and I was trying to break you. Oh, there's something over here. Can you jump that? Jump it, you bitch. Get out of the way. Oh, it's our boy. Wait, are they fighting, fighting each other? Marshal sent me needs help. Guess you got other plans. At least we found them all in one Seriously. spot. Enjoy your meal, no problem. Easy now, gentlemen. Why would they be eating each other? That doesn't make any sense. Fun times we had? Hey, Steph. So sorry.
Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. You never did have a brain between you. Oh, tits! Oh, it's the guy! <laughs> Dude, it's him! Blood looks the same to me, bro. Alright, let's return. Good to know that the, uh, the sheriff is doing a great job protecting his town while he's sitting in his cushy little, you know, place of business. Not having any problems. Hello, John. Hello, Marshal. So, you find the boys? I found them. I understand. I hope it was fast for them. It was fast. And they died with their bellies full. Well, one of them did. Good. That there's Jonah's gun. You keep it. Here, you keep it. After all, you earned it. Thank you. Take care of yourself, John. You too, Marshal. Mars. All right. That's another mission done. It's like your entire trip along the way. I feel like each of these missions brings you to a place you've been along the way, and it gives you a stranger mission. They're not really strangers, though, are they? All right, next one coming up. Hit the brakes. Oh, this is where we found that one guy. Um, remember for that story? So it's, you know who it's gonna be? It's gonna be her husband who died many years ago. Remember the one we had to find and he had already died, but she was like crazy? Since she was the one at the other place, he's gonna be the one here. I can almost guarantee you that Peter something or other was his name. It's been far too long since I played this though, so. There's literally no sense in um, shooting any of them until you start burning all the coffins. Oh shit, I didn't see him. Oh, I didn't, oh, I got two for one. Oh, let's go. It's a little dark, it's hard to see him. Uh, eh, might be a little far. No, it's good. It's a faster reload. I don't know if I'll hit him, but we'll try. Oh shit on sticks! Shit, his head's gone. I don't know if that's the glitch or if that was just a headless guy. Nah, it's glitch fam. God damn it, that's so annoying. Let's switch up to the repeater for now. You just can't shoot as many. Yep, it's Peter Turner. I thought so. Poor Lick. You are a dead, 
I mean, yeah, Toasty, I work out all the time. Not all the time, but like frequently. As, fre as much as I can. What's up, Red? How you doing? All right, it should save, but it's not like a spot that it's gonna spawn me at. It'll spawn you at the nearest. It should save, I think. Look for a save point. Yeah. So it is saving, but I'll have to. If I load, it might spawn me back at the a town I'm not near. So it's kind of like one of those situations where, um, should I go here right now and finish it up, like? Wait. Oh, you're living. Hi. Hey, Rex. It's pretty bad, though, that this is still a problem. You know what I mean? Like, it's like, bro. It's like an E. This is something that EA would let happen, not Rockstar. You'd think they'd fix it after all that time. But it's happened a lot. Like, a lot. But I don't remember this happening at all when I played it. Back in... 2011. I mean, this in particular is not. I mean, the base game was that I had, but I'm using my disc. I, I bought this game back when on disc. All right, this is the perfect time to get a get a town because it'll auto save and then you can reload from here. This is a small town though, so it shouldn't take too long to get through it. Oh no, wait a minute, it won't actually work because <coughs> it, it once it's glitched, none of the none of the heads, none of the kills count. It's fucking annoying, man. Cause this is an easy one to take care of. Yeah, you're better off just fucking loading it. 11:18. That was just two minutes ago. So I'm gonna load. I'm gonna load this one. The graveyard did auto save, but I'm just not sure if it's gonna spawn me at the graveyard. You know what I mean? Like that's something I'm not sure about. No, it didn't. That's what I thought. See, that's what I was trying to avoid. But to be honest, I guess it's not that far. How? But it should be good now. I mean, we have to go through the Ridgewood farm anyway, but it just brought us further back. So yeah, the auto saves, it only auto saves in towns near beds. Come on. It's a bit of an issue, honestly, Come on. but. Making good progress, nonetheless. Yeah. Come on. yeah, see, the digital version. I, I mean, I thought I when I bought the digital, I thought because I had to re. I never actually owned this game. I think I had rented it when I originally played it. Yeah. So I bought the base game again now, right? And. But then when I went to play Undead Nightmare, it wasn't installed. So I thought it came with it, but apparently it didn't. So I downloaded, I had a disc version of Let's Undead go. Nightmare. So. Yeah. It could be because I'm using the disc version, but you'd think there'd be an update anyway that. Oh, fuck off. You know what I mean? It's, you'd think it wouldn't matter. Because usually when it emulates a game, It, like, basically is just there for the sake of it. Do you know what I mean? Oops, didn't mean to do that.
And then I get to, to finish it, I can honestly just give him ammo. Tried to target him. There we go. Save point. Okay, I'll go save here just because we got to get a Manny save here. Now, it should, because it auto saved, it should be fine like you know what i mean i should be able to load and it'll spawn me here but i like to just have a uh, like a hard save wherever that might be i mean i did yeah all right guys so we're just gonna go ahead and I mean, I've gotten it, I'd say, what, three times, would you say, guys? Three times so far? I mean, it's all about strategic, because the thing is, you can't progress these um, locations. Like, I can't clear these out without actually... Because they don't register that you're killing them, because their heads don't exist. So even though you're getting kills, it's not progressing, like, one of these areas, saying that you've cleared it or made it safe or whatever. So that's a concern. I mean, it is a pretty simple load. You just load and it fixes it, but... It's not always the best because you could be far away, so. It really just does depend. Anyway, let's go finish up Seth's mission. Mommy's making a puby salad, and I need Seth's own dressing. And then we can go see our good friend Wes Dickens. But you know what's funny about this is I don't remember this glitch back in 2011 when I played this. I don't remember it. And I'm playing the same disc. But then again, I'm playing on Series X and I was on my 360 back then. So that might have a, a change. It, the emulation could be a glitch. You know what I mean? But obviously this only happened in Undead Nightmare. It did not happen in the base game. Oh, wait, no, you don't need to do that. Oh, yeah, it's still really cool. It's just you got to do some workarounds, that's all. It's kind of, it's more of a nuisance than anything. It's not like it's game breaking. It just, it's just going to be like an obstacle that we have to deal with. Clean their clocks, baby. Went down like a sack of potatoes, I tell you that much. Oh, come on, Johnny. I, I didn't mean to hit two limbs, but...
Oh, shitty dicks! Oh! That guy was around the corner. Jimmy Saint killed by gunshot. Wasn't that the guy from the gang? This guy I can't remember. Quick, we have a shit hook. Shit, I don't know if I clipped him or not. Oh, that's dumb. He, he doesn't shoot all the way around. You gotta line up your targets accordingly. All right, where's Jimmy? Did I? I must have shot Jimmy Saint. I didn't see him. Oh, the funny man. Right, 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 right. Forgot about him. All right, so I gotta go back to Sethy boy to finish it up. Watch him be like, oh yeah, I guess that wouldn't do it, would it? And you're like, what a waste of time. So how many places can you clear? Looks like one, two, three, four, five, six more. I've actually cleared most of them. I'm at four, I'm at five. So I'm, I'm under halfway, but they're not that hard. I mean, it's a fast travel. I wonder if I should just go do this one. That way I can fast travel back to Sethy Boy. I think it makes sense to go do a new one. You know, that way you're not doing, you know, double dipping the same thing. Oh my god, man. Come on. I hate that the horse is like, I'm gonna go and jerk off in another county. Like, dude, I need you nearby. You're an apocalypse horse. You'll be fine. You're made of fire. Come on, come on. The only weakness you have is if it, there's a big downpour. And even then, I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Okay, that's a big no on Jimmy. Oh, nice jump. There you go. We'll have to play it by ear as well. Down the land down and do. I hate when the waypoint leads you to some stupid spot. This is probably one of those. Uh, oh, yeah, this is the mine. Oh, it's huge, bro. That's a huge bitch. Bro, is his head gone? No, it's there. Okay, stop changing the targeting. Oh my god, that's annoying. And there I go. Oh, that's really fucking annoying, guys. I'm surprised this is such a large town, but I guess the mine is huger than anything you've ever seen. I shot him in the face, so I don't know, or sorry, in the shoulder. Shit, I'm reloading. Oh, I hate how like jittery it is. This is a new weapon. It's my bolt action. 
Oh, dick's an ass! Thanks, Octavian. Just keep running, gunning, baby. Running, gun. Get it. Thirty for that. I got a huge chunk of ammo. Do you think they're gonna be in the mines? I wasn't sure. One more tick. Fucking die. Oh my god, this bitch is still dead. Or alive. Pissing me off now, bro. We need more. One more. Target it. God, that's so annoying. So it has to be like right on cue or else it won't work. It looks like I'm hitting him in the face, but it's slightly off. Great, they're in such bad locations. There you go, come at me. I don't want to leave the town and then... Wow, Dan, how do you miss that? <sighs> the head, please. You dumb bitch. Y'all are welcome. Kobe! Ow. Ow. Airbag's a little slow. But I've got to touch the floor. Alright, now we're over halfway for getting all... I think there's actually an Achievo for do. doing all, ha all of these. That real nice. That real nice. <laughs> Damn this godforsaken shithole! Alright, relax, Marston. Alright, alright, alright. I see we have a lot of rubrics in the audience. Alright, guys, let's spawn back at Sethy Boy. Uh. What is the closest way? Probably McFarland's Ranch or the. Wait, what is this one? This is Thieves Landing. Is Thieves Landing or McFarland's Ranch closer? Probably this. So let's go with Thieves Landing. What's up, boss? How you doing? Oh man, guys. This is fun. I forgot how fun this was. It's been a minute since I played. I remember this less than I remember the base game. Even though it was further away. Or, it, you know what I mean? 
I'll probably end up doing all these guys. I don't see why not. There's what only five five left. They don't take that long. So if if we're that's gonna be the rule. If we're near it, we'll go to it. I guess we're kind of near it. Tell you what, we'll go finish off Seth's mission for first. And then we'll kind of play it by ear, depending where they want us to go. I'm doing very well, thanks for asking. Hey, Jaden, welcome. Oh, she's dead. He dead, I mean, sorry. No time. I could have gotten ammo, I suppose. I'm going to pretend I didn't see that guy. Yeah, that would have been pretty sweet if they'd done Red Dead Redemption Undead Nightmare 2 based off the second game. I think it's... I don't think game, DLCs like this would ever exist anymore. What the... Why is it actually playing it? They're, they're actually... Okay. Alright, Seth. I am impressed well, Seth, and concerned at the same time. Sorry to interrupt your party. Hey, John. Come join us. We're having a jig. <laughs> John, have you met Mary Lou? What about Francie? <laughs> I did as you asked and cleared out the rest of the graveyards. Doesn't seem to have done much good. Good? 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 Is dead good? Are you good? <laughs> Stop with your nonsense, you annoying fool. What's going on? The world's turning, John Marston, and the moon with it. Woohoo! <sighs> Day follows night, and hate follows love. Oh. Okay, you asked for it, Seth. You either stop dancing and start talking, or prepare to join Moses and the rest of these freaks. Are you constipated, John? You look very angry. You get constipated when you're angry. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm warning you, Seth. Oh, I'm warning you, Seth. I'm warning you. Don't play with the undead, Seth. Don't chase treasure. Don't waste your time searching for treasure and discover only a glass eye. <laughs> glass eye. Well, warn all you want, cowboy. Seth, what is going on? Aztecs. Or, or Incas. Or, or it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's all the same. Once every 200 years, this land is doomed. <laughs> That's why we love it. Mexico. Mexico, John. <laughs> ah, Mary Lou, may I have the honor? Oh. You're a sick man. Okay. Let's go. All right, well, here's our... Oh, there's a stranger over here. Filth and other entertainment. I don't know if Plain View is actually... Now, do you think it's faster? I think it is. Okay, let's go. These ones, the small town ones are a lot quicker to clean. So I'm just going to go do it. And then we'll fast travel over to the west part of town. We'll go to that one stranger mission. Oh, shit. I don't think I got her in time, unfortunately. Sorry about that, madam. I tried. They were just all surrounding. I didn't want to shoot you. I had her targeted. That's why I stopped, you know? Anyway, let's get on with our lives here. Let's go to the next uh, spawn point. Unless I decide to just go to all of them. 
I might end up doing them all. I don't know. Depends how much time we have. Because I can't remember if there's anything in Mexico in this DLC. Ooh, e-break. I mean, having more spawn points is always nice, you know. I wonder if I'll encounter any of the other horses of the apocalypse. Would be pretty cool. This one is is a bigger settlement. I'm gonna guess it's a four tick area. Come on. What's happening? Oh, it's only a two tick. I think it's four zombies per tick, maybe five. So maybe 10 to 12 zombie kills to to cleanse this one. one more I didn't see her oh nice dude that went so fucking well and we got the rolling block for that what's up Connor how's it going well welcome to the club bro we do not care Alright, I think that leaves four more locations. I think there's two more north of me. I was in Tall Trees. I could have done that one right then and there, but... Yeah, there's this one here. I was supposed to do it on the way back. And then there's two more in the north. Let's just go fucking do them, guys. Why not? I mean, it'll give us more weapons early on for us to use. Um, and obviously, more ammo, more spots to fast travel, save points, all the goodies that we need. Come on! Since there's no camps. And then we're going to have to go. But yeah, I, they, I mean, Seth mentioned Mexico. I just don't remember if you go there. Come on. Let's go. It's been a while. Damn it, I forgot to close that shit again. Man, I'm such a fail. <laughs> yeah. My daily routine, I'm forgetting so many things. Let's go. It's kind of weird when the sun goes out because it's it's deceivingly like peaceful. Yeah. Oh, this is the camp, right? The post, yeah. That's a good start. Missed him. I thought I marked him. Just fucking die. God, that's so annoying. Is it not counting again? Oh my god! This fucking game is so annoyingly bugged. It's 
Stop it. Now I gotta go back there and do it again. It's so discouraging, bro. It's like you're on a timer. And it's like when you go into certain areas, sometimes they spawn that way. It's a texture thing, obviously. I was like wondering why nothing was counting. I'm like, there must be a, a, a headless motherfucker somewhere. Come on. And yeah, it'll never get fixed too. That's the thing. It'll never get fixed. This game is too old. Unless they were to remake something, but I don't think they would. Not at this point. What's annoying is it was almost done, so it almost saved, but now I gotta... I mean, fortunately, that's the thing. When you complete something major, it will put you in another save point. So having all these done at least will give me a save point that's sort of nearby. You know what I mean? So if I had only done one or two, I might have to walk a lot further. Or even if I do spawn at the wrong one, I can always fast travel to the right one. It's just unnecessary is what it is. Finish him. Finish him. Ah, oh, you fucking ass. He had to reload. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. I'm literally mashing it. Great way to fucking finish them, you just mash it. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Why did I do this before? Oh, I gotta reload! Shit! Try that. Oh I, oh, I thought I targeted the one in the back. Ah! Dead. Dead. You want some of this juice? Ten Tommies. How about you, Sideburns? You want some of this milk? I'd rather have a beer. They don't got to know about it. It could be our milk. Oh, Fyodor's kicks is going to be a soccer player. Eric is pregnant. Congratulations. <laughs> Alright, we'll save because we ain't taking no chances. Then we'll head up into tall trees. And we'll chop those some bitches down. With our Tommies. Blackwater is under attack. Oh, God. Can't you lose it? Oh, God, I forgot about that. They made it so you have... But you don't have to do it as much. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> ah! Oh! What a bunch of assholes! I come here to save your town. Why'd you spawn me a mile away? Stop it! Anybody else want to dance? And 
die, you dirty prick. Guy's getting torn the fuck up. All right. Well, anyway, let's go to this house, and we'll fa we'll have to fast travel. Yeah, it's gonna be faster in the long run. That really del that like w that was a bit of a detour, though, guys. I have to say. I can't remember if I can go in this back door here because this is the professor's building, isn't it? Oh, you're gonna make me go upstairs? All right, wait, where were we going? I'm going to the Manzanita post. And we'll go up to the top. Oh my God, look at that bear. It's a demon bear. It's a zombie bear. Zombie bear. That's it. Combine zombie. Zombine. Get it? Mm. Uh. All right, back up to tall. The thing is, annoyingly, we were already up at tall trees. It's a bit of a hike. Oh my god, bro. Where is my mother, father, horse? Are you able to hop the fence? Do you want to go to brunch? Go. Do you want to go to brunch on Sunday? <laughs> Is that asparagus? Is that asparagus in your omelet? Oh, it's pesto. I thought it was asparagus. Oh, it's pesto in your omelet. Is that pesto? Oh, it's asparagus. I thought it was pesto. Alright guys, well unfortunately because it's in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, there's not going to be that many zombies. But you know what this reminds me of this kind of thing? And it is Rockstar. It is Rockstar, so they're pulling the same chains. Reminds me of San Andreas, when, when you didn't have all the areas not under attack, you'd have to go back and save one. Fuck you, man, I'm busy. You know what I realized? I can mash like crazy. Look how much I'm mashing. And his health doesn't really drop. That must be the perk of this particular horse. He's not the fastest, but he can sprint at a higher speed for a lot longer. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Watch it. Watch some place go under attack as I'm doing it. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to go that way. Yeah. 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 Hi. Oh me, oh my. See what I mean? His health never drops. His stamina? He's got like unlimited stamina. But I know there's faster horses. It'd be cool if we found another horse. I'd try to use it. Because four, horse four horses of the apocalypse, there's war. Isn't famine one of them? No, not famine. Is it famine? It's famine, isn't it? War, famine, death, and then there's one more. That's cute. It's just gonna automatically... Dude, keep the waypoint alive, big player. Here we go. 
Pestilence, that's it. I never remember pestilence. Let's go. We're almost there, big players. This is gotta be the end. If it glitches here, I'll be a salty ass Sally. You won't you wanna see ID. There's a lot of guys here. Start running, don't die! Oh my god! Fuck some shit up, baby. That's quite the horde, honestly, coming at me. It's because it's only a four shot. Oh, that's all I've got ammo for right now, big players. Fine, then we'll whip out our old... Dingleberry revolver. What's up, Mal? There's a lot here, even though there's only one. Put this thought baby to bed right now. There you go. That's as long as we get the save, that's a win God in my book. Damn it. This was one of the small this was only a single tick. Where's the save point at? It's probably where Dutch's camp was. They're gonna make you go all the way into his little humble abode just to save and fast travel. Thanks for the help, dipshits. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong bin. Great. Honestly, this is probably the, one of the safest places. Although, one, I guess dead guys can wander in from, like, the top of the mountain. John Mike. All right, we are heading back. I think there's only two of these locations left now, guys. Yeah, so I'm going to go to the this one. I'm just going to do them. So we're going to spawn an armadillos. Armadillos nuts. And we're going to head north. It's almost like they knew we were going there. I'm doing mighty fine. How are you? C considering the circumstances and considering I'm dry, I'm riding a horse with made of fire. I think it's pretty good. Been through the desert on a horse with a flame ass. Yeah. Let's go. Pray to God there is no rain. <laughs> For real. Rain comes in, this horse will have a mighty short life. This one should be a small town as well. Let's go. That's a triple. Oh god, get off! He can handle it, I can't! Stop! Dude, I... That's so annoying. Get off, then. I'm surprised this is a three-tier city. Or not really a tier, but you know what I mean. Shit, I hate... They all dead. Whoa! Damn, 
That move is so OP. I love it. for his fucking head. That's just a waste. Oh shit, gotta reload! And that's all she wrote. Volcanic pistol? Oh shit! That's gonna be fun. Would I sell my likeness? I mean, I, w I don't know if you need to sell your likeness to do something like that, but I'd be like... I don't know. To preserve my ass? Sure, why not? Not my... Well, I don't know if I would, actually. That'd be my family's. My likeness will belong to my family. Okay, only one more place currently to take. So we're gonna go ahead and... We're gonna the, f the closest one is Ridgewood Farm. We'll go up to Raskeller Fork right about now. The Funk Soul Brother. Again, I don't think I ever did this, so I might get an achievement if this is the last one. I have never seen that bread, no. I've never ever snipped my beard after a good meal. <laughs> that is very interesting. That is also very weird. There is some in Mexico. That makes sense. So there's a lot more than I thought. Let's go. That's okay. At least we'll have it. Come on. But goddamn, it's pretty fresh. Oh god. No, that's how they get you! I'm gonna die. That's all I've got, fam. Oh shit, we got all five of them. Let's go. There's a lot here, holy shit. Oh, 
Only three more to go. That was fucking sick though, man. Explosive rifle. Not again. That was a lot of fucking enemies, bro. Alright, where's our next location? We will save. That's all the areas in this region. See, I guess all that leaves is whatever's... Oh, I gotta go here. Is there anything really close? Not really. Filth and other... Wait, which one was that one? Didn't we already start that? Isn't Filth and other... Isn't that the one where we killed all the... Uh, whatchamacallits? Honestly, there's nothing really close. I mean, I guess Ridgewood Farm is kind of close. Closer. <laughs> Close that. Just put it away. So we got a bit of a hike ahead of us for this one. Unless it's the Chupacabra. Whoa, I almost got annihilated. Come back here. I win the horse runs away from you. Stop it. Stupid fury or war, I should say. I hope I have enough time to actually finish this today. Unencountered towns. Oh, there was actually more. Oh, shit. Okay, so in order to do this one, I have to do this one here. So there was more than that. Makes sense, because they were all scattered except for here. I just hadn't gone to... I, I hadn't gone to this location yet. I mean, I checked. I'm like, in terms of main story, I'm over halfway now for sure. I think there's eight total missions, and I think this one is like chapter. F I think I just finished four, possibly three. I can't remember. Come on. I'm still on track. That's kind of garbage because I killed the first two, but it didn't trigger them. Oh, no! Wait, it's still counting it. No, it's... Oh, yeah, it is still counting it. What the fuck? Some people's faces aren't spawning. As long as they're... As long as they're zombies with no, with faces, it will be fine. But if they're not... It won't count. Get up, John! Maybe not. Might be bugged. Yep, it's toast. Gotta go back again. Man, this is just ruining the flow of the fucking game. And I fucking hate it. I 
don't get it. Fucking garbage. I probably, you know what? I should maybe like save it and then load it. Maybe that's what I should do. But now I got to do that big walk again. It's just wasting my goddamn time. Maybe like it'll give you like a fresh kind of. What did I say it was? Don't run by me. Do not run by me. I will end your life. Man, the moon is massive. Come on. That might explain it. Come. Okay, wait till it triggers. I'll have to, I mean, there's another town where what's-his-dick is. That, that I think it's a smaller town, because I think I know where he is. Let's go. Go. I'll wait for the meter to start climbing. didn't go up meaning that guy is still breathing oh Jesus Christ It's annoying because you got to turn around to get like a shot on him. a waste. I didn't mean to do that, guys. Oh, I didn't mark the last guy in time. I was just on the verge of it.
All right, good shit. Saved. Let's go start this mission. Well, can I help you? This fucking guy. Forgot about him. <laughs> He's like directing. Mr. Marston, well, I might have guessed you wouldn't have got the Lurgy yet. Not yet. I'm trying to help my family. Yes, quite the hobby of yours, that. Sure. Listen, any idea what the hell's going on here? No, but it's brilliant. Man turned against man. Kind-hearted neighbors turned into savage, flesh-eating monsters. This hit? Make a fantastic movie. Who would enjoy that? What? What kind of sick person would like that? My kind sir. The lowest common denominator. My people. You're gone, friend. On the contrary, sir. You misunderstand me. Come now, you're a smart fellow. Allow me to illuminate. <laughs> Listen, Mr. Marston. What I need is one of those nasty buggers that spits poisonous snot on you. If in your travels you can find a spare one, we can make moving picture history. You're worse than they are. Each to their own, Mr. Marston. But if you find the time... Do I have? Does it have to be Gap Tooth Ridge specifically? A Wretcher. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, well, I'll I'll get my horse. Oh, wait, no, wait, not yet. Hold on. Let's um. Get out of the fucking way, my God. Okay, so we're gonna, I'm actually gonna do this. I'm gonna load it to start kind of fresh. That way if the glitch spawns in, it'll kind of be, you know, fixed. I should maybe do that after, wait, what the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa hold on, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I load the wrong fucking game? This one. Sorry, my bad. Jesus, that scared me. I was like, what the hell happened there? Not again. We're not going down there again. Okay, there you go. That's better. All right. So, Gap Tooth Ridge. So, Ridgewood Farm is probably where we're going to have to spawn then. I think a Wretcher, like I said, is the ones that spit the green goo. So we'll have to, like, grab it, bring it back. We'll, like, lasso it, tie it up, throw it on the horse, and bring it back. I can't remember what the retros are. I'm pretty sure that is what it is. But let's just make a waypoint. Just roughly this, this you know, area. Hey, Simona. Go! Thanks for that. Man, this battery has lasted me days without needing charging. Like, it's lasted me forever. I can't even tell you. I've been using it. Like, the battery of a... The battery on an Xbox controller lasts, like, a long time. Come on. Gotta give it credit. 
And of course I have yet to see one. Now that I've captured that one location, it might have actually bit us in the ass. Because naturally now there's none here. So like, am I fucked? Like, that's the thing I'm concerned about. Shit. Don't go and annoy me. I would cross the tracks to avoid this dormant, but not now. No! No, dude, come on with that bullshit. I was trying to <sighs> restart near town. Restart near town. Yes. Fucking bitch that was. Wait, what just happened? Okay, so upside is now... I guess I'm closer to that. Well, no, but I I, I got stuck. I was, I was gonna kill him. I just... Then I got attacked. It was a bad... It was a shitty series of... Oh, no! Nope, that's not happening. It's not happening. I'm not doing that. You lose everything. Fuck that shit. Is it still the wrong horse? Yeah, what the fuck's going on? Why would they do that to me, bro? Ugh, I hate how long this is taking now. This side mission's like, kind of a grind fest. If the horse is gone... It, it shouldn't be, though. It... All right, now it's back. Good. Hey, Patriot, what's up? Shit, man. What's annoying is I'm not... Is, I wonder if it's going to even... Oh, here we go. Here's what's gonna happen. Oh shit, no! Dude, they're gonna kill me, watch. I need to rep a different weapon, it's too slow. still bite and spit at me though why is the horse all the way over there I wonder if I should go back and find that guy he's about here right just to get his treasure map I'm gonna pop a cap and him and his lady after that after what they did to me.
Oh, he appears randomly? Damn, hey, that sucks. So I had an opportunity and it was... It, it blew it. Yeah, this is where he was, roughly around here. Well, that's a big old oof street. Alright, well, let's mark back. Yeah. Oh, hit the brakes. We don't have any mods in the chat. It's funny how, like, I have, like, so many mods, but it's somehow, sometimes, Go. there won't be... Go. They, they just happen to all not be there at that one particular moment. Hey, Stanley. After this one, hopefully that'll be it, and then I can go start the next mission, because we've been doing sideies for a while. Let's go. God, bro. Stop. Don't die for this in Paris. Stop it. <laughs> Guys, he's not taking... It... Stop moving! Jesus. Stupid fucking horse. A tiger. Think. Think. Bro, you owe me so much oh, fucking money for this. Mr. Marston, I see art has got the better of you. Stupidity got the better of me, but I felt I should help an old friend. I appreciate that, sir. Are you ready to watch the creation of magic? If you say so. I hope you get it. Wonderful! Let's put the star into his first seat. Right over here. You can put him down here. Oh, oh, oh. Lovely, lovely. Movie making history, my friend. This is not going to end well. At all. Ready, ready, ready. I see you. You're going to be stars. Do something interesting now. I mean, anybody could have predicted that. Anybody. Should've done this a long time ago. Oh, right, you, I forgot you turned. Sorry, brother. You freaks are starting to annoy me. Anyways, uh... I'm actually going to save it again, you guys. Just because I don't trust anything or anything that happens. Okay. <laughs> Finish the movie. Yeah, set him up and he'll be the new guest star. Alright, we're actually going to go here. But we've got to do this last uh, area as well. And again, the horse is in another district. Look where, look how far away he is, man. It's just... Yeah, I'm over here. Yeah. Clearly, a war is not the answer. Because it doesn't ever come when it's called. And if it does, it runs right by you and just teases you when you're about to get there. 
I mean, I should have known that was going to be the case with this horse as soon as I started trying to break him early on when I couldn't even jump on his back. Jamie. That might have been Vice City, Annie, I think. You had to do that. There was like the 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 movie studios missions. GTA Vice City. We gotta get into Fort Mercer. Howdy. Hey, someone's out there. He ain't one of them. Open the gate. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of something else then. Howdy, mister. Howdy. You're gonna be okay. No. Step right up! Step right up! Don't be shy now. Don't be shy. Nature confounds us, but science saves us. That's the truth, sir. That's the truth. West Dickens patented tonic. The only 100% original, 200% guaranteed cure against the undead stalking this earth. It not only brings health and fitness to the sick and needy, it repels the undead and saves souls! Why, it's a natural miracle! And it's available now, here, at the low, low price of only 100 solid gold coins! That sounds expensive, but what price eternal damnation! <laughs> you, sir! You look healthy. Would you like to give it a try? Me, sir? Yes, sir! Would you care to demonstrate the undead defeating possibilities of this patented elixir? No, sir, I would not. What I would like is for you to stop peddling this nonsense right now. 100 gold coins? Well, what price would you pay for survival? You tell me, Mr. West Dickens. You tell me. Well, since you put it that way, um, why don't all you chaps all take one for free now? And uh, if you like it, when you like it, you'll know where to find me. Uh, you won't find any undead around me. <laughs> Take it, enjoy. <laughs> Thanks a lot, John. These people have lost their families. They've lost everything. Well, that's not my fault. I'm just trying to make an honest living here. No, you're not. Well, uh, okay. But can I help it if demand is high? High? I'm offering the people hope, John. That's a precious commodity. The tonic really works. <laughs> These poor, awful undead creatures can't stand it. <laughs> Come here. Take a look. Something he makes actually works, which is just hilarious. Yeah, how's that working? Works like a charm. Uh, well, it wasn't quite what I expected. Stuff is like catnip to those bastards. Uh, well, I, I, I need more desert sage and uh, violet snowdrop, and then I know I can cure this foul plague. It's a lure. Back to doing your dirty work, am I? Now, don't be like that. Don't you remember the good times? Please? I'm an old man! All right. Here. Take it. Maybe you can use it to attract some of them. Okay. I'll see what I can do. And thanks. I'm sure this will come in real handy in case I want to meet some new and interesting friends. <laughs> mm. In 
interesting. Hmm. All right, we got the bait now. So it had the polarizing effect, but obviously... Oh, it already is a safe zone, so I don't actually have to do anything. This stupid fucking thing is under attack. Are you kidding? Oh, God. Ugh, I don't want to do fetch quests at all. This is ridiculous. What the fucking hell? Yeah. I think so much for a safe zone. Unless, of course, they're talking about it on top. I think I'm on the wrong level. No, these guys are just walking about. That guy shouldn't have been here. That was a fail. Anyway. Uh, I, I choose my mods based on just a few things. I guess long-term streams. Like how long they've been in my streams for. Um, how frequently they come to said streams. Um, uh, what else? Obviously maturity level is important. Some people just want to be mods for the sake of being mods. I'm on Series X right now, Amir. Okay, what am I doing? Uh, I have to go find a bunch of shit, which is annoying. So I have to do this first. Five Violet Snowdrop, five Desert Sage. So that's easy enough to do. But I've got to go. I think the Desert Sage is what? Um, where was the Desert Oh, it's in this area. It's actually in this area. So I can actually leave. The Violet Snowdrop, I'm not 100% sure. Ugh, I'm not 100% sure where. Mm, I did not pre. I don't pre-order games really anymore at all, Zach. The way I look, I mean, I'm gonna end up getting that game as a part of my EA Play Pro subscription anyway, so it'll be the best version. I haven't even looked anything into it, so. Annoyingly, I did have that thing that made us find it, but now I've got to, like, go around looking for the stupid shit. Okay, one thing I'm not sure... ...is, um... Oh, survivalist map. That's what I want. There you go. Forgot I did have some. Um... It's fine. It's fine. John, get up! Jesus Christ, he's taking a nap. Oh, wait, did they... Sorry, was it Desert or Red Sage? Oh, it's Desert Sage. Shit, am I in the... Oh, I'm in the wrong one. Damn it! Ah. I thought it was Red Sage. I gotta go up to Gap Tooth Ridge, guys. That's the problem. Alright, well, that's on me. So what I'm gonna do, actually, is load. Uh, where was it? Uh, 39. And I'll fast travel to one of those towns, and I'll get it from there instead. Yeah, 30 fucking beavers. Oops. Oops, 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 oops. I will go to Gaff Tooth Breach. I'm sure it'll be in that rough area. I mean, the thing is, do we really need to pre-order games anymore, though? At best, you get a pre-order bonus that's not even that good at whatever's in-game anyway. So it's like... You know what I mean? So it's kind of like, is there really a point in pre-ordering anything at all? You're guaranteed a copy. The reason people pre-ordered back then is to guarantee yourself a copy back then. Now you don't need anything. You know, like it, like it's you can never run out of a digital copy. You know, so.
Oh, wait, this looks like, whatchamacallit. Oh, no, this is our desert sage, right? Yeah, this is desert sage. Oh, that's wild fever few. That's the wrong one. I guess we'll still take it just in case. What is that guy crying about? I guess I can go take a look and say what's up. you eat your friend the random encounters are cool they're just things they didn't need to bother they didn't need to put them in the game but they did which I think is kind of neat stop horse Two more desert sage. Yeah. It's a shame I didn't, uh, I, I, I hadn't re realized that this was his mission. Okay, now we just gotta head over here. So we could fast travel. To uh, the next location, which is in Tall Trees, I believe. Cause that's where the violets, anywhere there, like the mountain, basically anywhere there's like snowy shit. I was worried my homeboy would die there. Sorry, guys. Nothing personal. Again, it's always good to save. And I think that'll take us into... So, wait a minute. My question is, should I go to... I think, yeah, Tall Trees. We don't actually have to go up to the mountain. We'll go to the Manzanita Post and head into Tall Trees. So, hold on. I'm going to go back there, and I'm just going to kind of put a thing a roughly in there. Okay, I guess a question I've got is... Um, if I don't go back and save a town, will it, will I lose it as a spawn point? I guess is something to ask. Cause that, I don't know. I guess I could leave it and find out, but I don't want to take it back. Unless it's only there to kind of like. Oh, there was, yeah. Shit. I don't like it when games do that, man. It's just, it's, I don't want to be doing the same thing over and over again. But the thing is, I think the defense is faster. What was it again? Thieves Landing, correct? <sighs> God, that's so fucking annoying. I'll help them, I'll help them. And by all means, just spawn us outside too. With my horse nowhere to be found. Come on. Let's go. You 
You guys are useless, man. I'm telling you. Good. That's death. That's death. No, 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 no. No. Fuck. <sighs> this is so unnecessary, man. I don't want to go and defend them every five seconds when I'm doing stuff. Boring. Are they still fucked? Yeah, well, they're in better shape, though. Wait, let me look. No, that's my last save, yeah. Death by water, man. It's not even that deep. Come here, bitch. It might be because I got to them in time. No, it's the same. Oh my god, when you get overwhelmed, that's when you think things start to get a little dicey. I didn't even kill him, did it? Have I ever been carjacked? No. Dan, have you ever been held hostage in a terrorist situation? 
Oh my god. I just saved them and that's the thanks they get. Run my ass over with a horse. Anyways, now we got to go to where we initially were planning. And actually try and find what we need to find. Alright, let's have another one of these. Weird how they don't appear all right away, you know. Easy. I think that's what we need, right? There we go. No, that's wrong. Um, I'm not sure if I'm far enough. This looks like hummingbird stage as well. Ah, here we are. No, not here we are. That's not what we need, bro. We need something else. I'm wondering if I'm not close enough, and I think it might need to be colder. Yeah, let's go further north. Come on. Yeah. Well, it's snowdrop. Here we go. I don't know if it's worth going down there, so we'll just keep heading this way. That's what I've been after. Wait, what is this guy talking about? I ain't gonna bite you. Come and join me. What in the shit? Yep, a little bit of whiskey to soak it in, and I reckon this will be good eating. It all started just after the plague hit town, you know. My brother comes home shot up real bad. <laughs> Oh, wait, am I actually eating? Dude, I didn't mean to. Why am I eating something? I didn't tell him to do that. He says he don't want that <laughs> Why is he eating it? He said he wanted me to do it, you know, to kill him. I just put the pillow over his face. But the thing is, you see, I was real hungry. This guy's now dead. I've heard it all. Treasure map. Nice. Uh, Toasty, I don't think there's such a thing as a chop shop cartel. I don't think that's a thing. There are criminals who own chop shops. Sure. It's part of their jam, but... Yeah, there's no cartels devoted to chop shops, <laughs> 
I picked up an arm and ate it. It was an it was like a zombie arm. No idea, Chris. No idea. All right, let's save and we'll fast travel back to the main hub. Man, I gotta piss and I'm hungry as shit, so I gotta. S no, but this is, you make it seem like there's a million cartels, though. It's like this is the uh, so you, so in that I guess by that case. Um, there's, uh, tax evasion cartels and petty larceny cartels. There's the cartel, a drug cartel. They don't, they don't have cartels for that other shit. <laughs> they might have a finger in it, but it's not like it's a unique cartel just for, you know, just for that shit. I'm actually going to spawn at Plainview. There's a Plainview one, right? Yeah. Burglary cartels. Yeah, exactly. Money fraud. Money fraud. Uh... <laughs> Insurance fraud cartels. <laughs> they just have a cartel of people who just get hit by jump in front of cars as they drive by. <laughs> The jaywalking car to exactly. There's a. <laughs> you can't park here any time of the day. 24 hours a week, 7 days a week, no parking cartels that enforce that shit. There's the meter made cartels. You don't want to fuck with those guys. The indecent exposure cartel. Another satisfied customer, Mr. West Dickens. Oh, hello, John. Yeah, poor fellow can't get enough. As I see. He looks pretty bloated. Get rid of him, would you? Why? Uh, well, because we're old friends. No. Uh, uh, because uh, we'll team up and fight the forces of darkness together. No. Uh, because I've got something you want. Uh, uh, trust me, you cynical bastard. Actually, there is a specific cartel where you're not allowed, allowed to tell people about cars. So if you tell them what kind of cars went through there, that's illegal. So that's the cartel cartel. Oh, did you get the stop? Of course. Oh, excellent. Wait just a minute. That's the extra one. That one you don't want to fuck with, man. That's the worst of the worst. Ah, here you go. Now these should help. If I've got my mathematics correct, they'll blow the buggers apart. And if you've got your sums wrong? Ye of little faith. Now listen, John. You're going to need some more serious weaponry. I've got a plan. <laughs> but you need to pick up some old parts at Riley's charge. Another shopping trip. Yeah. Well, this fucking guy. Excuse me if my efforts at salvation are interrupting your busy social calendar, John. I'm only trying to help because. Because we're, we're old friends. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you better not be wasting my time. Uh, me? <laughs> Never. <laughs> Perish the thought. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sometimes I think I've been drugged. All right, find the old parts at Raleigh's charge, return them to West Dickens. All right, where are we going? Over here. It's actually not far. Is that the only one? I think so. Let's go. Coat your bullets. Set undead ablaze. Can we even do that yet? Come on. Let's 
Let's go. You'd think you'd call it the Maple Syrup Militia. Like, that's got a better ring to it. MSM. Yeah. Oh, man, you don't want to fuck with those guys. They're MSM. Come on. MSM? The Maple Syrup Militia. <laughs> They're like a serious gang, but they have like... Like a maple logo, and there's an actual like syrup icon, you know, on their on their like emblem, mixed with like I don't know. And they found out a way to make like a, a Molotov cocktail out of it, except they just yeet it across. Wait, what's that? Missing. So oh, it's a missing soul. Aren't you supposed to guide these fuckers back? Well, I'm not gonna do that right now. They gave this, they, they're, they're the true sticky bandits, the maple syrup militia. The sticky bandits were a part of the maple syrup militia, believe it or not. They were grandfathered in. I thought I died for shoe. The first one I have to do to complete. Are you shitting me? Fine. Where is he? Where is he and where's Wes Dickinson's? Wes Dick's. You know what are those those things called? <laughs> They're like real instruments. But some guy literally just nicked like What is that sound? Dude, I would I'm I'm not gonna be surprised if it like a an alien spaceship comes over the horizon. Time of enormous crisis, I might have known the government have you boys doing the work of a common clerk. Well, thank you for your input, citizen. I'm glad you find the laugh so funny. <laughs> My pleasure. Do you think this poor girl's family finds life quite so funny right now? Family? I assume she was a common killer. She's a missing person. Missing presumed dead, I guess. But you keep cracking them jokes. I'm sorry, mister. I guess I spoke a little out of turn. I ain't the one you should be apologizing to. Just find the girl. She's 15. Millicent Waterbury. All right. Take down the poster. All right, where's Mills? All right, what's closer? Ridgewood Farm? Fa Ridgewood Farm. I think Ridgewood Farm. Mr. West Dickens? Mr. West Dick? Mr. Bottomsley. Get away from me! <laughs> no, you owe me $20! <laughs> Get off my goddamn grass! <laughs> Ridgewood.
the horse is always like doing something something completely different I'm ready to go into Mexico though but if I have to do this as a part of the mission fuck them that's why What's up, Xander? Yeah, so far so good, man. How about yours? This seems a lot further away than it initially let on, didn't it? Pleasant's house. Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming, relax. Off of me. This stuff. Pop a few domes. Send them home, baby. Four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there were seven of them. Wow, Dan, you suck. Are you Millicent? Yes. Come on. Your family's worried sick. I love how no one bothered to go rescue her. Like, went to go looking for her. They're just like, fuck that bitch. She's 15. She's old enough to have her own farm and a few oxen. What were you doing out here by yourself? We were so hungry. Climb on. Let's get you home. Sorry, finish your story. You were hungry? Oh, you dirty, dirty bitch. What's your name, mister? John. Reginald. John Marston. Reginald Waterbury. I've heard that somewhere before. You from around here? Wait, isn't she I a Waterbury? I'm down here, but I live in West Elizabeth. I have a small farm up there. My wife and son, they've got the infection. That's terrible. Do you think there's a cure? I sure hope so. Otherwise, well... I don't want to think about the other one. Oh my god! It's like Beggar's Canyon back home. Look at all these zombies. Holy shit. No Wee! No, I'm on Xbox Series X right now. They've they've uh, optimized it for the Series X, so it's in native 4K now. Here we are. A few other enhancements I can't as well. Seem to get away from this place. Wow, that took me about five minutes. Thank you. Good luck helping your family, Mr. Marston. What happened to her? Jeez, look at her lips. Did she get the poison ivy? Like her mom's lips. Look at his Way lips! Just like him, Mr. Comedian. A pain. We got a whole host of missing folk. I did your job faster than you've even like, you know what I mean? All right, got me a semi-auto. Are right, we getting weapons? Okay, we're gonna save it, and then I'm probably gonna load it again if I'm honest, guys. Cause then I gotta bounce. I'm worried it's gonna glitch. So hold on, I'm gonna load, and then I'm going to 
step out for a hot second just to use the washroom and what have you. Oh, and it glitched. Why did it glitch now, bro? Fuck you. Damn it, man. What a time. So none of that... Sa I mean, I think it might have saved. Hold on. It's fucking done with this shit. It's just clo It's slowing things down. Alright, hold on. While this thing boots back up, I'll be right back. Oh, God. All right, well, here's me hoping that it saved right as I delivered her. That's my hope. Because I should still be there. It should have saved after the missing persons. Let's hope I didn't get screwed. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, fuck you! Bitch, man. Now, I, I have just have this feeling I'm not going to be able to do it. Like, th this game is just adding... Because of this bug, it's literally adding so much time to this run. I'm just getting sick and tired of replaying shit because it didn't decide to autosave there when every other time it does autosave. And no one wants to see the same fucking mission. Oh, this is someone else. Oh, this is someone else. Why did it say the same thing? Okay, we're good. I don't know if I really want to do this, but I, I, I'm kind of worried that it glitched out a little. Why would I start the game from scratch? Why does that make sense? Come on, come on. It's weird that it said Millicent, though, or whatever. Man, fuck this fucking game, honestly. Fuck this shit. I'm not doing it. She can go eat a dick. Wasting my fucking time. Oh my god, man. It's non-stop with this shit. 
I'm getting really frustrated. It's like non-stop. The same thing. You have to go all the way over there just to... Just to temporarily help them and then you go back. kind of obscured. Bitch. It's right in front of my face. I didn't even get off my horse one time. All right, we're trying to get to West Dickens this entire time. We still have to get... Okay, so we have to go back to Plainview. Yes, that's the closest spot. I didn't have to go do that, but it's better to get the jump on it while you can. I don't think so. I think the max emoji limit's like 10 characters, I think. I can customize it. The problem is finding a balance between um with like cuz some people want to convey a lot of emojis, right? And I don't really think it's spam until it gets into like 12 at a time. And even then it's not the same. It's like I guess that's what slow mode is for. But no, and uh, if you're a mod, you can pretty much say, like, all the, all the Nightbot rules go out the window. So you can actually spam as much as you want. It's kind of funny, but mods don't do that, but... Where's Dickens? Uh, Nigel! Where are you, old man? Better not have gotten killed. Under here! <laughs> Get out here. Are you alone? No. I brought the great mass hordes of the undead with me. Of course I'm alone. Well, it's not the undead I'm worried about, dear boy. 
I kind of like them. It's the normal people I can't stand. What's happened? No, don't be like that. I haven't done anything. Or stolen anything. Or even lied. That much. What then? A bunch of people just chased me out of town. They blame me for everything that's happened. I tell you, John Marston, I've been selling health tonics for years, from here to Timbuktu, and never once has there been a, a demonic bloodlust or the undead rising up. It's preposterous. Okay. No. They want to hang me. Me. An honest salesman. Can you believe that? Snake oil merchant who cried wolf. Well, yeah, something like that. Um, well, I'm headed south. I'm, I'm headed down to Mexico. I hear things are much better down there, not to mention the, uh, the climate and the nice locals, but uh, also the merciful lack of cannibalistic morons with infectious eye diseases. <laughs> oh, did you uh, get the bits and bobs I requested? Sure. Ah, ha, ha, excellent. Uh, uh, just a moment. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, there. I see. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Ah! <sighs> Here you go. <laughs> I risked my life for this? A blunderbuss? Is this a joke? What is this, 1850? Oh, ye of such little faith. You've been hanging around cattle and killers too long. You've got the compassion of a mass murderer and the intellect of a cow patty. I'll stick your faith in this gun where the sun don't shine. This is the weapon of choice for demonic horde killers everywhere. It's true. From Romania to Edinburgh and all the other places the undead roam. You can put pretty much anything into it and blow a bunch of the buggers away in one go. Makes your rifle look like a pea shooter. You better not be lying to me. <laughs> Would I lie to you, John? Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, well... Sorry, guys. I was wondering how long I could push this. Shit. Alright, of course. I had to do like a mock setup with my console. So it's in a weird spot because I don't usually use the Series X that much. I do others, I admit the occasional uh, <clears throat> sin of omission. But you never, dear boy. Now, I. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Now, I am headed down to Mexico. Is there any chance that uh, I will see you there? We shall see. Well, if you're interested, I should be at Solomon's Folly in a few days, trying to figure out a way to get in. I hear the border is not as open as it used to be. <clears throat> Ta-ta! <laughs> Alright, let's head up to the next mission now. Finally. Come on, come on. I read. Marston. What's going on? 
You got a passage into Mexico? Uh, for me, no. Uh, but for you, maybe. Uh, it all depends on your relationship with good old Uncle Samuel. What are you talking about? Well, uh, the border is indeed closed. But the army is sending a train down there. Now, whether it's to help the Mexicans there or to escape the problems here, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> but I thought things were better in Mexico. Uh, well, uh, better or worse, it's uh, certainly different. <laughs> so why am I going and not you? Ah, well, that's a matter of age, dear boy. The army don't have many recruits with quite my level of experience. <laughs> so... So, you are on your own. <laughs> There's a train at uh, Benedict Point, and it's leaving soon once they've got all of the soldiers rounded up. Okay. And uh, your venerable friend here has done some more help. I have found some less than happy campers who have given up on glory and abandoned Uncle Sam's ranks. Uh, they're hiding out at Scratching Post. One of them might give you a uniform. <laughs> okay. And what about you? Ah! Baghdad, dear boy! <laughs> well, either that, or Fort Mercer, or perhaps it's time to meet my maker with drool coming out of my mouth and a lust for human blood. <laughs> <laughs> you take care of yourself. I always do, dear boy. Okay, so this mission we should actually be heading into Mexico. See how far away we're sitting. Oh, it's just down the way. It's not far at all. either earn it or mm. obviously earning it is going to take longer but it's going to be better in the long run so what i'll help them out this is probably your way of earning it oh what the hell happened there okay i know inaccurate it can be sometimes what are you doing Shit, I'm oh, no, oh, oh god, I tried not. Of course there was a fence there. Which did me a bit dirty. Why do you get to just spawn in? Umpteenth amount of times. Oh whoops, I didn't mean to steal it. Dude, I didn't mean to! Bro, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know that was in it. I didn't want to deal with the consequences. I was willing to help you guys out. Oh, fuck it. Let's get out of here. Whatever. Ingrates. That is so dumb. I ended up helping them. Accidentally opened the wrong chest. I just didn't I didn't realize it was gonna be in that specific spot. If I did. 
I wouldn't have done that, obviously. Spending all that time clearing them. You did real good, soldier. Basic training was very thorough. Well, that's good. These degenerates are only good at horn and drinking. Let's roll out!
What's up, Alan? Thanks for being a member for the last 21 months. Appreciate that. Come on, soldier, move, move. All right, make Uncle Sam proud, soldiers. Come on. Clear the tracks quickly. Let's go. Where did he come from? They didn't give me any ammo, really. They all just pissed off. Sorry to hear that, Bill. That sucks. New talents available. Counting two at the moment. Wonder if I should head over there. There's a. It's not actually telling us what mission that is. I might zip over there. Let's go. Shit! Oh god, I hate when the horse has a mind of its own. I wasn't trying to go there whatsoever. How fast do I have to hit it? What's going on here? My shit's all tangled up. What's going on? There. Let's go. Okay. Come on. Come on. 
So annoying, bro. Why would they think that makes sense? I changed my mind. I'm going to go here to start the mission just in case it's a mission that requires me to go over there anyway. That way I'm not doubling back, wasting a ton of time. Because there's been a lot of wasted time. That bug is non-stop and it keeps ruining any sort of, you know, progression that we have. Another mythical creature. Shit. I'm not sure which horse this is. I think famine based on the flies coming off of it. It's just constantly got... Yeah, this is famine. Look how skinny it is. Man, that is going to get annoying, man. This is madness. I don't know if this was a good, good horse to get. Just kind of looking at it. Um, I have a feeling that this is probably the worst horse of the lot. But I guess the question remains, is there, is there any way... Yeah. Um... But they must have perks, right? Each one must have its own unique perk. Oh yeah, sister. You okay, sister? Well, I'm alive, senor. Although, come to think of it, I just committed a mortal sin. Claim self-defense. Always works for me. Yes, well, I fear my judges may be a little more stringent than yours. Uh, but I appreciate the advice. Unfortunately, many of my nuns are not so resourceful as you or I. 
Their innocence will kill them, which is truly a terrifying reality. I would not know. I think maybe you would. But let us leave the psychotherapy and focus on more pressing matters. They are locked in the church, while hordes of, of, of these half-witted demons are, are trying to get to them. It'd be my pleasure. You're a true Samaritan, sir. You know, they say the devil has all the best tunes. It may be so, but it seems he also has the most half-witted friends. <laughs> so you know Bill Williamson, then? Excuse me? Just a little joke. I'll do as best as I can to save the nuns. Let me guess, I have to go throughout the country, and or not throughout the country, but throughout this area anyway, and save as many nuns as I possibly can. Rallying the nuns, the sisters of the cloth. Okay, so there, yeah, so this, we're going to have to clear this zone anyway. What do you do? Get in there. Why are there so many layers to this one? Damn it, sister. Some areas of the game so loud. Like this area is insanely loud, guys. Famine's fastest? He didn't feel that fast when I was, when I was riding him. I thought death was the fastest. That was a waste of ammo. I missed like all the major shots. Interesting, I didn't realize that. I try to run away. Sometimes your guy just gets sucked in and you just start running in that direction.
Where's this bastard? There you go. Sometimes you gotta let them know, you and I, T.Y. Let's save up, guys, since I know it just saved, but I never trust the saves. That was a lot of enemies, though. Must be above us. Yeah, emulations tend to be cause problems. They're never the same. They never run the same. Well, I didn't want to save on that one. Whatever. Okay, well, we got to plan our next move. Mother Superior Blues. Hold on one second. Okay, so yeah, there aren't too many of these missions left, believe it or not, so... We're actually doing good for time. I think there's this one and one more mission after this, and then there's like an epilogue chapter, so... We'll spend some time, you know, getting what we need to, so we might be okay. I assume there was way more to it, but maybe not. It's sister. a sequence of missions, that's the difference. Bless you. But it's not sister. It's Mother Superior. Mother Superior Calderon. Our bishop was a stickler for regulations. <laughs> Until he got sick last week and ate half of the cathedral choir boys. I'm sorry. I only mention it because my girls are laughing at you calling me sister. What do you think is causing all this? Like, he's supposed to know? Like, come on. Déjame ver. Mexico is an old country. Many faiths have lived and died here. Many evil spirits have flourished. I have no idea what is afflicting the people here. But I know it is a sickness of the soul. Something supernatural, maybe. Certainly nothing rational. Perhaps if you were to get me a live one of these creatures, we could try a couple of experiments. Certainly. Get me a new one. One who was recently human. I want to work with a subject who has only recently turned. I'll see what I can find for you. Gracias, señor. <laughs> Cállense. No puedo creer cómo se portan. Bring in normal undead. So that's literally any of them. My, I guess my question... There's not going to be any in there. So what I'm going to do then... Is let's go here. It's really interesting that Famine would be the fastest horse. But then again, I guess it is kind of going pretty quick. Usually the one that's like, the sickly horses aren't healthy, well, obviously, and they don't run that fast. So it's kind of interesting that they've done it that way. So when there's one left, we'll tie him up and bring him with us. Well, maybe not. Might not be able to. Such a badass way to take them down. Apparently, bashing him in the head is like an instant kill, which is kind of interesting. A little bonk for him. I can't see any more through all of those ones. Oh, 
I don't know if it's gonna count it if I hog tie one. Hey Caleb. So say, why is this all super loud? And then sometimes it's like whisper, whisper, whisper. I don't know if this is considered a regular one. I might have to get it somewhere else. Yeah, it's not gonna count it, guys. But there will still be some out in the open, so we'll just see what we can find, and hopefully they're nearby. So I'll make a save. I hope they don't do it where, yes, like, one of those, like, you know, something gets attacked while you're in Mexico, and it's, like, one of the, you know, settlements elsewhere. That would just be kind of annoying, but I wouldn't put it past them. Because that would happen in San Andreas all the time. You'd be on the other side of the map, and you had to get all the way there. And it's like, you must be joking. Alright, what we're actually going to do, like I said, is load the game again. Uh, what time? 14.01. We're going to load this just, just as a reload. Caleb, what are you doing? Stop with the spam. You know what? Fuck it. Let me do it then. There you go. I don't get people are so confusing. It's just like, why must you be so strange? Why must you do these things? I'm not saying being normal, but bruh. <laughs> Stop disrupting. <laughs> Disruptions. It's non-stop. Anyway. Let's go to the next one. I think this is the only stranger mission in the area. I think there's only one in Mexico. If my list was served me correctly. So I think, therefore, this might be my last one. I don't like this horse. It's just not not even that it skills. It just looks weird because it's so like skinny. I preferred war. My guess is there's probably two and two, so all the horses are in like there's two in each region. Oh, that's a sharp turn. Did I find a new one? It must be El Presidio. Oh, I just missed. Well, I, let's see. What happens if I did this? Should I go back for it? Yeah, I think I should. Whoa, hello. I mean, I can go back with that regular dude, but I'd rather do it when it's when I'm nearby, you know. Oh, it's another one of those. All right, let's just move on. Random encounters, you know? So is this even, so it's already safe, so I don't even have to worry about it. Well, that's all right. Free safe zone. I like the ones where you don't have to take them over. I have a feeling there's gonna be an achievement when you get capture all of the zones.
really this so far? Okay. <laughs> Do you think I like shooting women, you filthy whoremongering wretch? Gracias, señores, que estaba viendo a mi tía, que tal vez ya desculpada. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. Go on. Go on, get it. Eh, ándale, gracias. Hello, Mr. Ricketts. Hello, John. I see you're enjoying another vacation in our little resort. Something like that? Well, we got sunshine, sand, and a plague that makes people eat each other. Come to think of it, it must feel just like America to you. What is going on? I thought things were calmer in Mexico. This is calm. What's a little light cannibalism among friends? Excuse me. So, how have you been? Good. Well, apart from my wife and son being tied up and trying to rip my soul clean out of my body, <laughs> and the entire earth turning into hell. Good. Real good. You know, John, I've lived a long life. I've seen this land when it was just wilderness and scrub. I've seen missionaries nailed to crosses by shaman and burn into just the cinders of their misguided devotion. I've seen slaves get set free and return to a bondage even more confusing than the one they left behind. I've seen diseases wipe out entire communities in a weekend. I've seen bad men make their own Valhalla out in the bush, with harems of maidens and the hunting of men as a sport. I've seen men struggle with principles and morals and the very meaning of existence. I've killed all that can be killed. Never, in all my natural-born days, seen anything quite like this. Nor me, sir. Now, if uh, we could only get something that uh, would attract these blighters, we could kill them faster and and maybe return this land to its uh, natural state. Some kind of bait? Exactly. I think I might know how. And more dynamite. I'm running pretty low. Let me see what I can do. Thank you, John. And take care. Okay, was that a freebie? With undead bait and dynamite. Do I have dynamite? Yeah, that was a freebie. Let me look at my provisions. I mean, I have undead ribs. Do I have do I actually have dynamite though? Yes, I do. I have dynamite, but I don't know if I have undead bait. Might as well save while I'm here. Is that on the upper level or a lower level? Lower. Oh wait, do I actually have to grab one? I must have what I needed. Mr. Ricketts. Hello, sir. How have you been? As you imagine. Sitting Good. out in the rain like a badass. Did you get the dynamite? Yes. Mm. And the bait. Huh. Oh, that shit. Right, right, right. Let's see. Uh, 
So it's essentially like a pipe bomb style where it draws them, it's a lure, and an explosive. Wonderful. Here. Let's work with that for a second. Ah, uh, this uh, calls for a soft touch. Not the brutish hands of a man of war, but the delicate touch of an artist. Some uh, use oils, and some a chisel and a block of marble. For me, sir, it uh, was always either high explosives or the trigger of a fine iron. But it's much the same. Sometimes your humility overwhelms me, Ricky. <laughs> you and me both, Mr. Marston. Now, if you'd have seen me when I was a young man, if you'd have seen me when I was so fast, you couldn't see me. Well, then you'd know this is humility. The truth is, well, the truth is long dead. Now we got only memories. Memories and a great swath of demonic mutants, of course. <laughs> Have you heard anything? I heard a man in Chicago was writing a biography of me. And can you believe it? An artist in Pittsburgh painted my portrait. I mean, the demonic hordes. Not your own unending glory. No. Oh. <laughs> that. Nothing too interesting. Someone said that there's some really big problems near Escalera. But I can't concern myself too much with that. This is my home now. This, and this up here. Take care of yourself. I will. I don't think getting savaged by some brainless corpse would do too much justice to your myth. <laughs> yeah, I think you're teasing me, Mr. Marston. But I thank you. And I appreciate your concern, nonetheless. Alright, I think that's about everybody. For side missions, anyway. So, from what I've seen... There's three more. So, there's, like, the one here. One, two... Sorry, there's four more. There's one over here, as well. We'll see what we can do. I might as well head over there since I'm here. Come on, famine, where are you at? How do you know that, Toasty? But the game's not available yet. I think the travel might get a little repetitive, but we don't, I don't say we think we really know much about the game enough to make that judgment call. Ah, trailers don't say shit. Get up. I gotta run away. Just finish them. They're too close to me. I just found one of the uh, other horses. There's four horses of the Apocalypse, Tyler. So there's four special horses you can find and tame. And I would found the war horse earlier on. And I found another, like the famine horse, which is what I'm on now recently. Oh, 
Holy shit. Why did the volume get loud as fuck? Like, I don't understand why it's doing that. Hold on, let me see something. I wonder if because it's a different game. No, it's still all the same. Oh my god, if this guy killed me. I'm so glad. I thought for a second it was gonna glitch. Like, you know what I mean? I hope you're really dead. Yeah, it's really bizarre, and the fact that they have it all in the same like audio source is infuriating too. Well, I never go in like based on hype. I think it it the, the concept of Hogwarts Legacy is cool. Um, I worry though, because I thought it was getting, um, oops, where am I going? I could have sworn that it was getting delayed, so it wasn't, it, initial release date was February, but I thought it got pushed back. That was what I had heard. So, I mean, usually when games get pushed back, it means it's not ready, so, and if they do release it at the same time, that's probably bad news bears for all of us. But... I mean, it could be dreadfully generic. You know what I mean? I guess we'll find out. I'll take that. I don't think anybody should pre-order shit, though. I don't think it's necessary anymore. As soon as I save this game, I'm going to reload it. It's been a while since I've saved. So I'm going to... Or, sorry, since I've loaded... That way it'll reset everything, you know? Takes just a second. Alright, well, there's this over here. It's a bit of a... Well, it's not terrible. God, where's my fucking horse? I don't know why it ever... It should, it should be right out front, but I guess I didn't hitch it, and that's my own fault. If I want it to be close, I should hitch it. Yeah, I'm always the same way. I'd rather it take years and years of it. I'd rather them delay it multi-years just to make a good game. But that's not how games are these days. You know what I mean? There, there's dead, there's deadlines and shit. We still gotta go back and deliver that one regular enemy for the sister, so. Or the Mother Teresa, I should say, specifically.
This one should be a pretty small location. Oh my god. Is this not it? It's probably part of a story then. What a waste of time. So I'm better off? Honestly, I'm better off loading. If this area isn't gonna isn't gonna go. All right, fine. Here's what we do then. We're better off loading that last game, honestly. Because what's the point in coming all the way over here just to end up in a dead end? So yeah, something must be story related, or maybe we have to wait a minute. I don't know, but find out in a second. I don't know if it's worth. I don't. Well, here's the thing: if we fast travel now, oh whoops, shit. Didn't mean to do that. So I gotta reload again. Okay. Let's see, is it still there? Yeah, see, it's not right now. So, I'm gonna go back to the Mother Superior Blues. I mean, it's on the mountain. Like, I have to go up it, but the question mark was right there. I mean, I know what you're talking about. Fuck's sake. Ugh, sick of wasting time. Whatever. Where is it? What is this one again? Las Hermanas? The sisters? Makes sense. I mean, if it's on the mountain, it's gotta be... Oh, I know what town it is now. It's that little tiny, like, village. It's like that... Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember doing that. Or running into that for that one mission. Armadillo is coming under attack. So, I had to do it anyway. I know, but the thing is, sister, I don't have one available for you. So, let's go ahead and take our trip. Honestly, if I can remove one mechanic from this game, not including the glitch... Ignoring the glitch, pretending the glitch isn't there. This back and forth. Once you cap it, it should be done. And maybe once you're done the story, then it gets overrun, you know? Yeah, 100%, Annie. That's how people should do it. But unfortunately, people build all their expectations up based on the hype train and, you know, gameplay they see. You have to go in assuming it's not going to, that it's all smoke and mirrors. I'm just wasting ammo now. And look how many, look, look how many tiers I have to, it's like, it's, it's one thing if the defense was like one thing, but it isn't. Look how many, like, zombies I actually have to kill. It's kind of horseshit. It's, it's very repetitive. I know I don't have to go back right away, but it's better to do it now than later. That kind of shit is so annoying, bro. Now what? I have to... Should I just fast travel there right now then? Like, instead of wasting 16 hours of time? I might as well fast travel and maybe hope that it's going to get overrun while I'm there. That's all I can think about. God, it's 
so annoying. You go back just to house clean and do this boring, repetitive shit. You know, and then you just die. And it's just like, why are you doing this to me? And then you got these clowns who run you down. Now we gotta go back. Okay, let's uh, fast travel back to the... I don't know. Uh, the sister place, right? Las Hermanas. Okay, now I gotta just actually go find myself a regular zombie and bring it back to the sister. It's funny, there's always zombies when you don't need them. But then there's none when you do. There you go. Okay, slow down, stop. I mean, I'm glad that was that one was spawned really close, so that worked out nicely. Jump for joy that you found him. Comfortable. Superior. The holy water. I think I have a test case for you. Senor Marston, you're a true pilgrim. That I ain't. Hmm. Now let's see. 
Well, it certainly isn't the flu. Their eyes are so devoid of love, of, of anything. Oh, lively one I see. Here. What is that? Holy water. I think we may have something. It seems to be working. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. But it seems as if you were nearly saved. Spiritual infections are confusing things, Senor Marston. None of us can hope to understand them properly. But he came back for a minute. I bless the water, but perhaps my faith is not that strong. I have to do more thinking, but I need time. Every day, more of my people fall as the dead rise in Sepulcro. Then perhaps it's time I put them to rest. Take the holy water. Maybe it will be a calming balm for the restless departed. Thank you. No, thank you. You are a blessing in an unusual form. Most definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't get snippy with me. All right, cleanse. So it's another cleansing series of missions. Where's the next? Where's the closest graveyard from? Oh, it's actually not far at all. another burning I didn't remember this DLC being having all these repetitive missions though Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Burn him, burn him, burn him. Alright, let's get to it. Just, just like one up and I'm into the. I don't think that did the trick. I like that when they're spawning in because... So you can do that. Shit. And these guys are non-stop. They're laying on thick. 
Wait, am I supposed to do something specific? Am I... Yeah, just clear out the graveyard. It doesn't matter. Santa, obviously. That was a very lengthy battle, to say the least. But I think that's why they made it longer, was because of how big it was. There's, I think there's fewer of them. Okay, what's next? So she wants us back there. I wonder if I should fast travel. I don't know. I haven't decided. Maybe we should go save. I mean, it's saved there, but... Is that really the last mission? Come on. Come on. I mean, there's... Well, let's see. What's the name of the missions? Let's see. A Civilized Man. It's still Mother Superior Blue, so not yet. I mean, I want to save it. But I'm worried that, I mean, I don't really want to be at the at night time either. Senor Marston, how wonderful to see you alive. I think I've cleared Sepulcro. You're a brave servant of righteousness. I've been called many things in my time, but never that. <laughs> Who is that girl, by the way? She? I don't know. She said she was in a holy order in Escalera. I'm sure I keep seeing her. Or someone like her. Maybe. But it is a common enough look. Seemed like a nice girl. She told me something interesting. What's that? She blamed this terrible curse on our soon-to-be president, Abraham Reyes. Perhaps you have heard of him. Of course I have. Heard of him? I know him well. I hope that vain, ambitious, and repugnant parasite is no friend of yours. Not exactly. I didn't think he was that bad. And who am I to judge? Forgive me. I have just heard many unpleasant stories and met too many pregnant and abandoned girls. 
Of course. But what has he done? She claimed he had angered an ancient goddess, disturbed a crypt and a temple in her honor. <laughs> I mean, as I say it, it sounds like heresy, like the idiotic delusions of a cursed people. But in a land such as this, I have learned to be less dogmatic than maybe I have been instructed. I am sure it is just folly. Perhaps. But maybe it's time I go pay El President a visit anyway. I shall pray for you. Someone certainly needs to. Goodbye, Mother Superior. Vaya con Dios, mijo. Okay. All right, so Rhea, it ends with Rhea. So before we do that, then, let's go here. I mean, obviously, I'm glad I didn't go this way because obviously that's something I have to do on the way. So I'm going to go back that way. I'm going to fast travel to... El no, I'm going to fast travel to... What's faster? Probably this. Casa Madruga. Oh god, thanks for the heads up. <laughs> I mean, it'll stop when I start playing. They always give you like a song that happens. Like during the final mission or whatever. What did I say it was? El Matadero? No, what is it called? Casa Madruga is the closest one we have. Yeah, it's playing like this like surf music. It's kind of dope. Okay, come here, horse. It's a shame. I would like to be able to play this for you guys, but... Oh, shit. I just realized... The entire fucking time, I had the wrong thing muted. Oh my god, I'm gonna get copyrighted, aren't I? Oh my god. Great. I gotta finish this before the six hour mark. God damn it, guys. I hate when I do that. I, hit, I muted the PC, not the console. Uh. So basically, I have to finish this stream in the next 40 minutes. Because if I get claimed for that song, I'm unable to edit it. So, like, I will get claimed for this song now, officially. Great. Yeah, this stream, uh, this is toast. Oh, 100%. I'm getting content ID claimed. And when it, when it, like I said, when a video or a stream is over six hours long, you can no longer edit it. All you can do is dispute the claim. So you can't edit the song out. That's it. We're toast. I did not realize that I was... I did not realize it. What's, what's annoying? So no credit for this stream. Yay. Yeah, it's going to get content ID'd and I'm toast. <sighs> Such a fucking idiot. I don't think it's fair that you accidentally you get claimed by something in the game. 
and the entire stream earnings now go to the owner of the song. I could get lucky and it won't get claimed, but I extremely doubt that's going to happen. <sighs> Fuck, I wish I realized it sooner. Oh my god, that's slow. Okay, is it done? I don't know. I think it's done now. Anyway, well, if anybody wants to become a member to offset that shit. <laughs> to offset all the cheese that just happened. I'd appreciate it. It's automatic, Anthony. It's um, it's like a system that YouTube has in place. So yeah, it's it's their content ID system. It lit it basically looks for audio like that matches. Like so, someone will upload their clip and be like, "This is what our clip sounds like," and anything. And basically, YouTube will scan any video on or future uploads. And it will automatically content ID the clip that is infringed. So unless that game, that song is now copyright free, which I don't think it is, your boy is going to get claimed. Sometimes if you're fast enough, you can like kind of stop it. But I wasn't fast enough. I thought I had it muted in time. So the only way I can offset this is if I finish this DLC. Like I said, if you keep the stream under six hours, that's the only way. So if I'm fast, I might be able to do it. But I don't think so, because if I wanted to get like any of the... I mean, if this is the end of the game, it's possible, but... Yeah, it's always listening. I mean, it's not the end of the world. It's just like literally, it's like every time, like if every video got content ID claimed, um, nobody would make any money on YouTube. So I'm not, basically I'm not, if I do get claimed, I won't get any ad revenue for this video anymore oops that's why I'm such a stickler for it it's funny people will be like oh there's no copyright and then there's always copyright all the fucking time so anyway this is our next stop it's on the way we don't have anything closer so I'm gonna go to Las Hermanas again uh... oh, where is it Las Hermanas thank you Hi, Andy. I mean, I could end it now, but then what? I have a stream that's like an hour long. And I lose any viewers I have. It's just like, at what point does it make sense? Might just have to take an L. I don't know, man. YouTube is so stressful to be on. It's like, you accidentally... I'm so mad at that, because I was ready. Like, as soon as I heard the music, I went to mute it. But I'm so used to streaming on the PC, I hit the mute PC option. Instead of mute the other one. You know what I mean? So, let's go. It's the way it goes. It's the way it goes. Oh, well, well shit. There you go. <laughs> Annie's picking up some pieces. Thank you, Annie. Appreciate that. Ten gifted subs. That is going to make a dent. I, I appreciate that. No, really, it does make a difference. That will definitely soften any blow. But hey, we could get lucky. Hopefully it's not an issue, but... There you go. Hooked a few people up with some gifted memberships as well, so... Oh, yeah, you can. You can... Oh, yeah, 100%. I can literally just go... Um, I can dispute the claim immediately, but they can literally come back and say... No, it's valid. You know, even if you have evidence, you can dispute it. And then you can dispute it again, but if they own it... The next choice of action is a lawsuit. So if they want to be like, no, this is ours. You're not going to make money off it. They will sue me. And it's never worth it. You don't want to, like, fuck with a company that's going to risk or that would do that, you know? Because you never know how big the company... I mean, the chances of a big company going after you are pretty slim. But no one is, like, is... No one wants to risk that. So... I guess I could try, though. And who knows? There's a chance that it might not get claimed, but I think it would. Yeah. 
But yeah, thank you, Annie. That means a lot. Really appreciate that. But hey, if I can finish this in time, I don't think I will. I'll probably be just shy. If only I'd hit mute, I would have been absolutely fine. I would have been fine. Let's go. Well, I'm going to complete it. I'm still going to do it. I'm just... Never mind. Never mind. Let's clear this... This bish out and... This is a big area. Well, this is Chuparosa. This is like the first town we ever go into. I love it when you get a full magazine on them. Oh no. Everything in this game is going wrong. Where was the last save? 1448. Yeah. I have to reload. The heads are disappearing, so the glitch is on. This is what I mean. If there were no glitches, we would have finished this plenty in time, but we're not going to. So, there you go. Thank you again, Red Dead. This is just a fucky stream. So now what? Let me guess. Do I have to go and... Yep, I have to spawn again and ride all the way over there again. Oh my god. I'm so done with this. Waste my time. Waste everything. See, it's stuff like that. It ain't happening. It's, yeah, we're not going to be able to beat it in under that. Because there's this mission, and then there's one more mission on top of it. So. Especially with all these setbacks. Come on. Fuck me. <sighs> Well, it's the way the cookie crumbles, guys. The way the cookie crumbles. Come on. I hate being... I hate complaining, too. It's like... Ugh, I don't want to sound like a broken record. I think it depends how some people look at it. If it's like a indie developer, I think they're more laps about it. But if it's like they're signed to a label, it's the labels that come after us, not not the actual artists themselves. But I'm just going to play as I go. Why are you slowing down? Let's go. You're an undead horse. Start running. Yeah, man. It, you know what it reminds me of? I did get a claim, though, from Let's go. Um, this one guy the other day on a Halo 2, my Halo 2 run. Like the one I did a couple of years, well, back in 21 anyway. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember that, but apparently uh, the guy who designed or created the music made it like kind of free to use. All of his like Halo 2, Halo music he did for Halo 2. He made it all free to use for people and some people took advantage of that and um, they've kind of and it was like basically it's like hey you can use my music in your videos or whatever. So Buddy made a song, a shitty hip hop song and it really sucked and he basically took the song and just rapped over it and 
And in doing so, he registered, or his label, registered uh, the song all, as a YouTube copyright, content ID claim. And um, yeah, my, my Halo run, and probably everyone else's as well, got uh, copyright claim for bullshit. And, like saying, oh, you use this guy's song. It's like, no dipshit, you took someone else's song, rapped over it, and then claimed it. But here's the thing, he wasn't a big label. He was some Joe Schmo record label and the video had like 17 views on it. And this guy's going around like in his label is stealing like ad revenue. I mean, I claimed it and disputed it and, I, and they released it, but still, it's not the point. You don't, you have to manually register. That's the thing, you have to register it yourself. It's not automatic. So they took the time to register the song, not thinking that, hmm, this game was taken elsewhere that's fair to use for people who play the game. You know what I mean? So what I could have done was I could have claimed his video, right? I could have actually created, copy pasted it as mine, registered that sound as mine, and then um, claimed it so when he posted his music, I could actually make revenue from his music. That's how easy it is to do. You don't need proof that you own it, nothing. You just go around and... It's kind of stupid. Let's be on kind of stupid. These guys are so irritating because they're hard to shoot. Ah, shit. That's a waste of a shot. Target at me, bitch. Yeah, but that wasn't even a big company, though. I don't think I've seen... See, they... I can't even talk to you guys. It's so loud. Like, the volume just escalates in this situation. Everything gets cranked in an event like this. Like, you guys have to hear that. It's so loud, comparatively. Just crank the fucking volume. There we go. Jesus Christ, bro. But anyway, yeah, that guy was... It was a small... It was a small uh, a company, so it wasn't even a company. It was probably just an indie guy, like a dude with his friend. It was just like Halo, some Halo background music, and he's just like, uh, I go to the club, and I'm buying Hennessy, and I'm from Tennessee. You know? You know? I'm a, I'm a gangster killer, the pussy filler. I'm from Manila, Philippines. You know, there's some guy in the background. I'm making bread off of others' content. <laughs> Wait, what rhymes with content? If they dispute the claim, they ass can get bent. And it's just like, I'm a hibbity hip hopper, a pussy popper, <laughs> the show stopper, <laughs> album dropper. <laughs> The turkey gobbler. <laughs> Would you like some cobbler? Meals on wheels, I got hella deals. Music I be steals. Chucking out banana peels. This shit is straight fire. Your mom is my desire. Give me that cash via wire. <laughs> I could take your higher. <laughs> uh, bow down to me, call me sire. 
I ain't no liar. This music is mine. Oh, spreading them legs, peering at the vagina. <laughs> it's just stupid shit like that, man. That's what I'm talking about. You got these guys like, bro, that's hot. That's some fire shit. That's fire, bro. We're gonna make millions, bro. Oh, bro, we're gonna make some fucking serious bank, bro. It's like, no, you're not. If you showed up to the record label with that album, they are going to give you some food stamps. That's what they're gonna give you. That's all they're gonna give you for that. So there you go. Sorry, I was passionate about that. I went off a little bit, but it's annoying. <laughs> it's just a tad annoying. Okay, so here's the thing. Should I go around this way first? Or is it part of the story? That I don't know. Like, I'm gonna give you guys another example. I know, I don't, I'm talking about this a lot, but there's nothing else to talk about. Um, so, I my Saints Row 2022 run, um, I've got claimed for... I think, I, I can't remember how many parts it was. I think it was a three-parter. And I've gotten claimed twice for the theme song. The theme song was created for the game, so it's not really claimable that way. So I disputed both those videos. Part one and two got claimed for it, for the intro. And, because uh, I was in the menu when I started my stream, right? So I was playing the theme song. And it was... So I disputed fair use, and it was cleared up. Then, the same fucking automated server reclaimed part one again and I currently have an ongoing claim right now and it's like bro how come you just get to constantly reclaim at once I've disputed the claim shouldn't I be free and clear once you've been like oh yeah sorry retracted you can't just claim it again for the same shit and do the same song and dance it's just like eat my dick what is happening All right, all right, all right. Beat him down. This is actually a small town, surprisingly. Well, that's just it, Brian. That's the that's the argument, right? that we are transforming the work into something else. And that, again, is that that's why it's a gray area online. It's like some are saying, well, you're not, it's fair use for that reason. You're altering the media for a certain way. But even then, when, when a game's song is designed, you were paid and the rights went to this, you're paid a job. You don't own the rights unless the, it changes hands afterwards. You know, that's possible. The fact that it's still so brutal, I mean, I will say it's come, the system has come a long way since, uh, you know, when it first came out. Like, I remember, um, for oh, fuck's sake, I remember there was a time, oh man, I really gotta shoot him now. There was a time when if you got a, co like, an active copyright or content ID claim open and you disputed it, Fuck this bitch. And you disputed it. Um, during that dispute, dispute time, no ads would play at all. Now, you can dispute it. Ads will still play. And once it's a sorted situation, uh, once once the situation's been sorted, whoever, whoever you know, the dispute is in favor of gets the ad revenue. So they kind of hold it in, in bar, or what do they call it? Not embargo. I don't know why I call it that. Escrow. Sorry, it's in escrow for a little bit. So there's a few perks about it, but I think they need to prove it's theirs by some sort of legal document instead of being able to just like sign up and be like, yep, yeah, it's fine, because I said so, you know? Right. But I've also been claimed for, um, sorry. Oh, what the hell? Bro, are you actually shitting me? Where's the mission? Dude, the mission disappeared. Oh, now it's back. But this wasn't there. Oh, man, I rode by that. Oh, my God. I rode by it. 
All we can do, guys, is hope that uh, I don't get copyrighted for this one. But, but anyway, as I was saying, sorry. I, I remember a song played. I remember I was so pissed about it. A song played for nine seconds. Or not? No, no. It played for six seconds, and I'm like, oh shit, this is copyright. I went and muted the song right away. I still got claimed. And I think it was like a six and a half, seven hour stream, and they got to keep all the ad revenue, or at least according to that thing, all the ad revenue, according to YouTube, is gonna go to this guy because six seconds of music was just, it was like a piano intro. So you didn't even know what song was fucking playing. It was six seconds of piano, and I'm like, oh shit, this might be copyrighted. I muted it. So no one even knows what song it is, but that guy gets it for, gets, gets seven hours of ad revenue for six seconds. That is the definition of fair use. Six seconds? That's such garbage, man. I, I mean, I feel like that's theft, you know? Because, like, you're making money off my likeness. But those ones are, those ones I usually just remove song. Like, I, I can't, or I dispute or something, whatever the case. Maybe it wasn't seven hours because I was able to remove the song. It might have been under six. Maybe five and a half hours of content. Either way, it's the same idea. It's still hot, like hot garbage. But yeah, the ability to... I, I will say being a gamer on YouTube is very difficult right now. It's, it's, it's interesting because it's very good and it's very difficult at the same time. Because there's a lot of tools available to you now than there were like 10 plus years ago. You know, you didn't really have anything. There was way more things. And now a lot of development studios want to work with you. But, I mean, it doesn't happen every time. But when you, when you, when you're, you know, you don't know when it's going to happen or something's going to pop up like that. It does suck ass. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, I, I mean, I guess they could, but. They're not going to sue you, right? So you can be like, reject, and if they dispute it again, you'd be like, okay, sue me for my likeness then, bitch. You know what I mean? You could you could say that, and it wouldn't even make it to court. It would get thrown out. Yeah. Shit. This, hopefully, t Tesoro Azul will be nice and quick. Yeah, it's a small one. Whoops, I fell. Oh, I didn't get him in the head. I hate that when I miss their head because they're like, their heads are so low, it's kind of hard to see. I'll s wait, did I see? I oh no, I reloaded recently, so we should be good for a while. Who else wants some of the sauce? It's probably on this side of the, uh... I haven't used this explosive rifle. Whoa! Oops, did I just kill my famine horse? Nearly. I mean, I, I'm sure I... That sucks. Oh, right. They can't die, can they? Right, there's a save. Alright, I guess there's not much. I mean... I'll save it and I'll fast travel. Save, load, fast travel, I think.
All right, wait, where am I going though? Um, Nozalinda. I feel like Punta or whatever is, oops. I feel like that's gonna be a location too, but. Oh my god, of course it's under attack. Bro, I don't have the time. I literally don't have the time to deal with that shit. I mean, mind you, it's it's in... I think I said the same thing, too. I was like, man, fuck that. And I think I just let them go. I mean, if I get claimed on this, guys, I'm still gonna... I always dispute it anyway. And I always have the same argument. But sometimes if it like if it's like Rockstar for example paid them to use their song and it wasn't designed for the game, that's a little bit harder to dispute because it's like, well they paid they paid to use the rights, you didn't. So if we paid for these rights it'd be like whatever. <laughs> Easy enough, but Senora Donde Donde is Abraham Reyes? <laughs> Tie him up. Do you see what your greed has done? Sorry, amigo. Had to be done. He always did have a way with the ladies. It's okay. He's dead. Thank you, senor. You'll be okay. I'm glad you think so, but I fear I won't. None of us will. We are all doomed because of him. Him? He wasn't a great guy, but I'm afraid you're giving him a little too much credit, my dear. Haven't I seen you before? No. He... He, he caused this with his greed and his lust for power. He heard an ancient myth and tested it. It caused all of these terrible things. His vanity overwhelmed us all. What the hell are you talking about? Where have I seen you? A me? Oh, I have a common enough face. I'm from here. He disturbed the royal burial grounds that lie underneath the town. He heard there was a mask hidden there that would make him invincible. I've heard this blamed on Mexicans, Jewish people, freed slaves, the federal government. Immigrants, the bad weather, now this. What's wrong with people? It's true. Look in that chest. He has a sacred mask. That is where this plague came from. Him and his awful lust for power. Where did you say the crypt was? Near the bullfighting ring. Behind the VIA. Well, I guess it's worth a shot. Return it. Stop taking shit you're not supposed to take. Take the mask back to its tomb. Wait here. It's too dangerous. Oh, hi. I know what needs to be done. Bitch. <laughs> I sure hope you're right. Just push her down. I'm just shoving him to the ground like a boss. Oh, he almost racked his nuts on that, guys. I'm 
I'm going in. I always told my son, never go into dark places with strangers. Gotta love that. Why aren't they attacking you? Cause she's a lying bitch. You really are a strange girl. Many of them died in that on this very side. No wonder they don't seem to like me. Time to go. Oh, <laughs> the ragdoll physics. It's a little dark down here. Only got 10 shots left for this bad boy. Long arm of Marston. I don't even know what that does. Certain kills, maybe. I love that insta kill, it's so brutal. <laughs> no! Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Christ, that was close. I'll say. This is not the time for your Nah, there's still another mission. There's no time for finish this time. Oh man, and I'm getting trampled, bro. I gotta get her out of here. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Thanks for the assistance, lady. How does it feel to be ragdolled? Return the mask.
Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. How do you know? My name is Ayotioto. Ayotioto. A horse is waiting for you. You should return home. Who shows Gracias? trouble starts I can pretty much guarantee you'll ride off into the sunset you feeling better <sighs> yes I mean once that boy stopped trying to bite me everything felt much better <sighs> I'm starving though Jack uh, me oh, well, I only felt better once that mad look left your eye please dad don't leave me here alone with that woman again uh, excuse me I'll try not to son Heard that before. Uh. Well, let me fix us something to eat. Please don't. We've had enough dramatics for one day. Fucking Seth, man. This is a pretty brilliant way to finish shit up. Let's go, Marston! Guys, I might have to cut this stream really close. 25 seconds. 30 seconds until we reach the six hour mark. I don't know if it's possible, but. I might have to just say bye and end the stream. There it is. Now we can play undead. Dude, 20 seconds. So we unlock death and we can play as an undead John Marston. All right, I'm going to cut this stream right now and I can still be able to edit this in case I get copyrighted. Thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate it. We'll catch you in the next one. All right, take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>